When I was in elementary school, I had IBS. <laughs> I don't want to know. Really? Septic yeah, tanks yeah, for kids. Yeah. What's your plumbing situation? <laughs> Can I check out your bathroom first? <laughs> Septic or sewer? <laughs> that was Korea. <laughs> I brought my own toilet paper. Push the wrong button. My apologies. Your fountain? No. Jet stream. But anyway. I'm going to be honest, too. This is probably the longest that I've actually listened to you guys' podcast. <laughs> why, why, why can't... <laughs> this was torture. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> here we go. Um, yeah. Yeah, here we are. You're in for the fourth? I am. I am. I'm in for the fourth. I'm going to try and make it a yearly thing. Oh. Um, well, I think an last thing. An annual thing. Yes, annually. Sorry. I'll make sure I say that right. But yeah, so here with the family. Super excited. I like come down towards my birthday time. Hey, and, your birthday's uh, on, uh, t- no, Sunday? Sunday. 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 We go to Monster Trucks. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, they go to monster trucks. I will not be going. I can't believe you're not going. I'll be going down water slides like with the kids, which I'm very excited. On Sunday, the kids are going to monster trucks on Saturday. So you're going to be stuck here with Hillary and Jess. Well, this sucks. (laughs) Yeah, Jess is here too. She is. Yeah, I know. Fortunately, but unfortunately at the same time. But yes, yes. My kids and wife are here, so that's good. That's good. I'm going to be honest, too. This is probably the longest that I've actually listened to you guys' podcast. <laughs> so sitting here, so this is, this is probably the farthest that I've actually made it. Three um, minutes. This is the most I've <laughs> yeah, listened to. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was going to say, so usually I Pretty just... Pretty good. I, usually I, what do you I think? Just, you I, just watch the... Uh, listen I to the... It. I do. I just check the little reels the that kind of get me up yeah. to date on like what I need to know. The reels that me... Well, uh, I guess the... Re- the later reels probably are a little bit more informative. The first couple reels are just to get, yeah, just to get it's, people. It's get, just like give the people what up. they want. You yeah, know? It's clickbait, like it's perverted per- jokes. Yeah. <laughs> it is a lot of clickbait because I click on it. <laughs> it, gets it you. It's prerogative. It gets the people going. Yeah, it gets the people I know. Going. And that's what gets me. Like half the time, speaking of the clickbait stuff, because I'm a headline reader. Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, hundred percent of the time, like, because you can't read, through, you can't I literally read. Cannot read. So whenever I see big, bold letters that I can sit there and really focus in on like the letter itself and then go letter by letter, I'm in. Hey, next, sound it out. Next, <laughs> yeah. next thing you're going to have to do is make sure you speak into the mic because people will get mad at you. Oh yeah. You got to like, people you know, like, we'll get mad for the free content. I feel like I'm like in a Eminem free, battle free, free, free. Yeah. There we go. I know. Is this good? No, you're good. I, you weren't actually not like Okay. I was just, yeah, but gonna, I'll give you a heads up. So you're not. Especially if you do something like this, like that'll like, that's too much. You now they to, get really angry. I'll, I'll let you know. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Ben will let you know. Thank you, Ben. Say like an NFL coach, like where they want to block, like yeah, yeah. what they got to say. Yeah. You get your sheet, yeah. your sheet like this, or you just like, it's like we've talked about before at state run media, just like when Angela. What happened to your arm? Sorry. Bike Sorry. crash. What, what happened to your arm? Bike crash. Good yeah. God. What was that? Uh, yeah. Uh, What's today? Friday? Wednesday. It's almost my birthday, so <clears throat> something like yeah. that. I got that new stump yeah. jumper. That's what you need. You like it? Yeah. What's it? For what you're going to want to do it for, yeah. you need a stump jumper. That's what I it's was It's like riding at. a freaking What's a Cadillac? stump jumper? That's the, uh, my mountain bike. The new one that I got back, the one that we had. I thought, I, I thought it was something like shout out out Technar. Technar. Like a, yeah. That's like a headline It's for like me. a pressurized like pogo yeah. stick. <laughs> I see. That jumps <laughs> over a, stumps. It's exactly, I mean, that's exactly oh, like what I'm picturing. It's the more trail bike, so I have... Specialized sent me those two bikes. We sent that one off to get, well, the other one's off to get painted as well. Uh, and I got it back the other day, the stump jumper. It's nice. It's very nice. It's got more travel than that Epic, which the Epic is great for what I'm doing what does in that Leadville. Mean, travel? So, like, the suspension ha- is softer. Oh, softer. Yeah. And yeah. And Better gas mileage. Nice. Uh, yes, on the Epic, yeah. You use yeah. less, less Like that power. boat suspension, like a Cadillac when Dude, you hit a bump that and just ride it out. stump jumper going down bailout was. In 22s. I was way outside where I needed to be. Nice. That's just, I don't know. There's no bailout yet. Well, and what's killing me is every time I'm hearing stuff like stump jumper, there we go. I keep picturing you pulling up to a stump and jumping over it. So that's what's kind of getting And there's a rock jumper too, right? The other one's a rock rock hopper. Rock hopper. Rock Rock hopper. hopper. Stump jumper, rock hopper. I want to know who's in charge of naming these things. Yeah. Pretty good names for a mountain bike. Pretty cool names. It is actually pretty cool, but. Speaking of, so I saw this video of this guy. Speaking of pressurized stuff, I saw this guy with a pressurized. Oh, I thought we were going to like submarine. (laughs) <laughs> no, no. Too no. Deep. Pressure- <laughs> Too far. Too a soon. pressurized uh driver like golf driver 
And so like you just set up and I guess it has like a CO2 can you put in the top of it and you just literally set it down right in front. Yeah. And it just launches it. It goes like 400 yards. So I can't hit a drive. I would love to have that. It's so cool. I swear if it wasn't for driving, I could be on the tour. <laughs> like if it wasn't for the drive. Um, I've seen you play. If it wasn't for the drive. <laughs> It wasn't for the job. And, and the if, I had tour. AJ, the tour. if I had AJ to get me <laughs> on close enough to the hole. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If, AJ, if you could scramble with AJ, you'd be on the tour. Exactly. If I could have AJ there with me the whole time, I would be on the tour. <laughs> hitting every shot until the putt. Probably Darren, the putt one time. I'm not any better on the driving a ball. I was about to say. No, like, where I'm are we not, going with this? But on ball. the... Remember that Young Life tournament where you hit the ball? Literally, he's lined up here. He hit it. Holes this way. He hit it straight at the people they that call were that teeing off in front draw? of us. I don't hurt. <laughs> no, that's a slice, but that's it wasn't a even a slice. I, I, there we go. I don't know how the physics of this worked out, actually. <laughs> I honestly the don't know either. Straight. <laughs> so right he was between, like he was swinging this he way. He was and swinging went that way. this way, and he hit. And I'm obviously. He and I honestly the, think I turned my body all the way towards <laughs> like the far left, too, just to like compensate for that slice. And I'm like, all right, here we go. Yeah. That thing, seriously, it went like a missile. It went right between. I, mean, I think it was like Mills Rogers legs or something like and that. Of course, and, and, and of course, like I'm in like just like awe of it because one, it was a hell of a slice, and two, there's people a hell of a standing shot. there. And like Rich like looks at me and goes, four? <laughs> and I'm like, Shoot, oh yeah, four. Oh, yeah, four. <laughs> yeah, four. Yeah. Like panic mode there. Yeah. It was good. I know. Going back kind of like to the mountain bike thing, just because just like as you were saying this, like this actually made me think like as a kid, so. As a kid, like, you always, like, try to jump in things. Like, yeah. yep. you know, I mean, I mean, that was always our, like, huge thing. Like, we'd all have those nice, Remember awesome. Remember the mini bike that we destroyed Dude. in the sand pit? Oh, what was that thing called? It was something Eagle, too, but it had the big, it had the big fat tires. It was, tires, like, the yeah. old school red, yeah. well, huge fat tires. Huge, huge, huge fat tires, like, the One shock on the front. Two, two. <laughs> two and, then, so, the front. and then, so, like, what happened is, like, Rich and Donnie always messed everything up for me, so I could never, like, enjoy it. So I just had to sit back and watch. But they were jumping, like, the sand pit uh, at our house because we were having, like, this pole barn built. So we had a bunch of sand there oh, getting yeah. ready. So they were making jumps. Well, I don't know why we were jumping towards pine trees. Mm -hmm. Like, <laughs> for, like, some reason that just sounded like a good idea. So they would jump it. And every time they'd jump, they'd hit the ground so hard the shocks would just, like, compress and <laughs> Oh, stick. yeah. So every time they get done, the person would take a sledgehammer <laughs> and hit the thing and it just this thing, This thing, had, you guys had had it for, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. five or six years. Yeah. And with six boys. Like, the throttle was gone. Everything so like was so, gone. If, so it would just stay running. So <laughs> yeah. it would take off on you. Like, if you didn't jump on it, it would take my first My first motorcycle. Yeah. You could twist the throttle back and let go of it, and it would stay it would stay locked back. <laughs> That's good so for you. You could just That's twist the best it. Thing you hold on for dear life. You would cram on that that like back brake, and you just hear the wheel just grinding. And it's just <laughs> running. And you're just like, hey, switch, 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 and you do the little you know like Houdini switch or the Chinese fire drill thing. Dude, I've been on Marketplace last little bit, just looking at go karts, and there's a yeah, there's a there's a Honda one. It's not an Odyssey. Here it is, the pilot. <sighs> pilot. Six grand. Pilot. Pilot. Oh, heavyweights. If anybody, no. I, is that it, the heavyweights one? Dude, I look, yes. Yeah. I, I look at these things. Not the every, van, not the high, Honda Pilot uh, or no. the CR or the. FL 400. <laughs> this is a two stroke, too, my, oh, wow. my people. <laughs> so if anybody out there has one of these for sale, are you trying to return had, to your former glory? Like when you had I have the a Bronco, middle child that I'm willing to. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you, had the, you had. The Bronco, you sold had, it. You had, had the, Bronco, the Odyssey, it. you sold it. Are you yeah. trying to, like, you bought a Bronco, you're back. Dude, I buy a lot of things, and then, like, as soon as, like, my wife, like, oh, makes, yeah. like, that little slight comment of, why would you buy that or something like that, then I start thinking, man, I really probably need to get rid of this because I don't want to spend 20 years hearing about it. So then I get rid of it, and, and then, then I you're gonna hear about it and buy another You're going to hear about it anyway, so you might as well just enjoy yeah. it. Yeah, I know. I know. Trust it's me. It's ruined everything. It really has. This Wait, podcast is making me sad now. I <laughs> know <laughs> uh, oh, it's tough, but no. What I was saying is going back to the mountain dang biking, mountain bikes, yeah. guys. Okay, because I was thinking about this. Like we used to have like this huffy like mountain bike mm -hmm. thing. Thing was a piece of crap. Mm -hmm. Oh, but we would jump the absolute. Can I say piss? I <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. Sorry. You already did. So okay, yes. sorry. Sorry. <laughs> we Scott. only censor. There's, there's only Scott, fix that, There's please. only certain words that get uh get knocked out. Gotcha. But we would jump the crap out of this thing. So then, 
He asked if he could say <laughs> piss. <laughs> I'm going to say crap, too. didn't even <laughs> say piss. But one time, I mean, like, no joke. So uh, so uh, my, old, like, my older brother, Matt, like, got off of the uh, bus, and he goes, dude, I got these things. And they were these valve stems or, like, something like that. that like, you put that this kid on the bus told him if you put it. Oh, black that, market valve stems or what? <laughs> that, that if you put it in the valve stem, had this skull, like, with red eyes. If you put it. <laughs> <laughs> if you the put eyes it, light up. If you put it in the valve stem as you jump, the lasers out of the eyes shoot on the ground and, and actually help propel you. Uh, <laughs> I was like, dude, that's genius. Like, I was like, why is no one like, why are these not for sale? Technology. <laughs> so, we were so excited. And I go, throw those on there. And he gets them on there. And it's like, we'd always like set the ramp up by our ditch. When you jump, you jump downhill. And it was just cooler. Mm -hmm. I, I would never do it, but I would always watch them do it. And I was like, yeah, of course. Darren was, uh, I was. a little timid when we were kids. I was very, very timid. And. He tattled a lot, yes. <laughs> and he had a stutter. I always had to make sure that I was fresh so I could be the first one to tell. But not a <laughs> so I could be the first not one a to like a, a, a stutter. Like he would say the entire word stutter <laughs> like, multiple times. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> There's a video. I, if I can find it, we were bike racing. <laughs> I didn't have those damn those damn things on. Oh, those stupid things on. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't have those so, skulls on, so I couldn't win. <laughs> I've said stems. this story multiple times, I think, <laughs> at Train with Rich, but when we were kids, there's 32 of us. 32 of us? Yeah. 30 there's, something. Yeah, there's too many of us yeah. on my mom's side, first cousins. 25 of us are boys. Well, they used to have us race around the pond, swim across the pond. Race, us out. race our bikes. At the time, we thought yeah, they were yeah. trying to figure out <laughs> yeah, which one of us was the most dominant. Yeah, they didn't. Give we it, now they didn't care. having kids, we realized they were just trying to tire us out. But that's part of the reason why we're also competitive. I'm 100 percent oh, certain because then they no would doubt. ridicule us. Whoever got lo whoever lost. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah like, would, wow, he's a lot better than yeah, you. Exactly. So, yeah. Exactly. Well, so yeah. me and he's four years older. Me and Donnie <laughs> and Matt and I don't even I think it was probably me, Donnie, Matt, and you. Yeah, and, and then and then it was like me and Kayla. And there's like some the other random cousins yeah. in there. Yeah. yeah. So um we're me and Donnie were four years older than these guys. And yep. Matt was two years younger than us. But anyway, we're racing around the pond. This is all on your mom's handheld camera. We have videos. <laughs> Shaky and, uh, camera. Darren comes back, me and Donnie come back in, and Darren, I think you even cut the corner and came back. Oh, yeah, I did. And then he gets in the camera, <laughs> heck yeah, heck yeah, I did. and he goes, why, why, why can't we, we, we win? <laughs> For the listeners, and that video I was extremely lives, out of breath, too. <laughs> <laughs> that video lives and in it was infamy. Windy out. <laughs> Anytime, like, Darren starts whining on a, a family text thread, that video somehow <laughs> shows up. I got to see if JJ can get us that video, because... You know, it's, might as well bully a kid I, for stuttering. I, I, I honestly, <laughs> I mean, I honestly cannot. Well, hey, look at you. <laughs> look at me now. I'm in the middle of, of a YouTube on yeah. a podcast. You're yeah. podcasting. Yeah. The best one time we were us. driving to Michigan and Darren to work <laughs> on his, when he, we first started the gym. <laughs> <laughs> no. no, it's funny. I just, so go ahead and finish. Oh, cause no. I just, cause I just read an article on this too. We, so we just ahead. started the gym. So <laughs> <laughs> this was torture. <laughs> <laughs> To, f to work on Darren's stutter in public speaking, <laughs> the whole way to Michigan, I'm driving. He's reading Eminem lyrics. <laughs> like out loud. Not singing them, just reading the lyrics. Yeah, I know. I was just reading them. And, I mean, oh, they're genius. If you ever sit yeah, down oh, and like, look genius. at they are. Eminem's but lyrics. They're idiotic. <laughs> yeah, really Shut the out. hell up. <laughs> Rich is like sitting there, and I can see him just gripping like the steering wheel. I'm trying to help him. He's like, like he's like stuck on a word. Yeah. You know, he was yeah. teaching Lakeland how there to read. They were big words, man. <laughs> the hard part is, too, is like as I'm reading them, I'm trying to like, or I'm also hearing him sing yeah. it. So it's yeah, like so you're kind of like starting to so sing a little bit. That's what happens. Let me give you guys a little education on a stutter. It's like when all this mumbo jumbo gets jumbled up, you know, like in your head, and you start overthinking or you start thinking about too much, you get excited. That's what happens. <laughs> you know, I have a, I, I have a lot going on. It's up like here. JoJo, the little circus boy. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I get going crazy. So, yeah, so, like, as, like, Rich is doing this, I think I got, like, halfway through the song, and it was, like, six minutes in, and, you know, and it's, like, a two-and-a-half-minute, three-minute song, yeah. so I go, I'm already missing the whole point of this. I forget, was it Cinderella Man? Uh, I, I can't remember. I don't There know. was multiple. But I just it read so that, good. so Ed Sheeran helped cure his stutter by reading Eminem lyrics. There it oh. is. Look at you and Ed Sheeran. A week of meals delivered to your door. Lately, I've been ordering a la carte options like bison burgers, salmon, turkey burgers, potatoes, and chopped chicken. Trifecta also has prepared meal plans to choose from, like paleo, clean eating, Whole30, and keto. Get 40% off of your first order and 100% off 
convenience at www.trifectanutrition.com forward slash Rich Froning. Look at me. You guys are that could be me. <laughs> that could <laughs> be me. <laughs> pretty much is you. That could be me. That guy <laughs> copied me. Um, yeah. Your I bet I bet the your stutter is how my handwriting is. Oh yeah, like, Angelo's because I'm just like think, I'm just I have so much going on that I get it on there, <laughs> and, and then like he'll be like, "What does that even say?" <laughs> well, Angelo's problem too is he he writes from the bottom on stuff. Not always, uh, really. Sometimes and it's not. It's definitely not text. Somebody book. called what me I out too. Like I, I have a problem. Like I started writing diagonally because of so many years on the well, whiteboard. No, yeah, but so many years of being on a whiteboard. For some reason, I developed like this diagonal. Oh, right. me too. Like, I, like you're I not used to writing online. Yeah, 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 for, yeah. I say I, I cannot write straight across. My handwriting gets progressively worse on a whiteboard as I get lower. Yeah, I have yeah. to like lower myself yeah, yeah, down yeah. because yeah. then it just like you can't turns write into down straight. It has to be like has to be writing. You have good handwriting. I'd like to think so. Yeah, I have to make up your something. Yours is pretty terrible. Can't read, can you? What mine yeah, is? Yeah, I've never, I, you need to work Scott on that. is almost as bad as mine. It's like a cracked out chicken writing or something <laughs> like that. Crazy. Yeah, because I'll leave it. We'll do workouts at work, and I'll leave it on the whiteboard <laughs> like for the next guy to do it. And they'll yeah. be like, dude, who the hell is, whose kid is down here practicing yeah, their like, I don't want to work out anymore. <laughs> They can't like, even read. Yeah, they'll come down. He's, and my B's, my lowercase B's looks like look like. Well, here's sixes. the problem. You still use lowercase. Yeah. Oh yeah. He yeah, actually tried that he too, actually helped me with writing like with all caps because I'd look at his hair and I'd go, God, that looks actually really good. Yeah, it does look good. All I caps stole it from my grandpa and my dad. Both yeah. my grandpa and my dad writing all caps. caps, but they're still like, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, and like, then like something all about caps, like all the smaller all caps yeah. after the baby, after the yeah. first one or something. Yeah, and it just yeah. it just cleans it up like look everything. Looks it's, yeah, it's yeah, I like know bold. it's completely grammatically incorrect, but I've well I've think. tried it, but my problem is I don't know the like I don't know <laughs> don't how, how to, to capitalize. Well, I don't know how to capitalize. <laughs> well, I guess I do, like but it takes panicking. more time. It takes more time. It does, and that's right? the problem already is that writing takes so much time for me that yeah. I have to speed it up. So I just speed so it, it looks up. Even worse. It looks so when I was in college for four months, <laughs> I had to completely <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I had to completely yeah, I what, was the, what was one of the classes you took? A walking class. I took a <laughs> I took an art class. <laughs> what else did I take? I had I had like a pre like a prereq like Algebra class <laughs> that, but like Walking taking. <laughs> okay, hey guys, right, you tell your story, and I got questions. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, sorry, I, I didn't mean it when you were taking. Well, no, class, I mean, but seriously, it's so like I don't want I would, Angelo you. So on a ahead. serious <laughs> note, in the four months of college that I spent, so I still have four years of eligibility left. So I can still really click. I can really still <laughs> go to BYU. Yeah. <laughs> I can, yeah, I can still really attack. No, I'm not Mormon. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like taking notes was so frustrating because I would write in all caps. So I had to just completely like scratch that and then I could not take notes. To, I, yeah, I'm like, well, I give up. <laughs> I give guy up. Who, I quit. College. Be the guy who takes the picture. You know, people are always taking pictures of them. Like, You're never going to use so, that. They didn't have camera kid, phones there, there, oh, There's this kid that like, sat like next to me. His name was Dave. Super smart kid. If, if he's listening to this, Dave, thank you for those four months. Because <laughs> like he would, because he would like get done, and be like Dave, just give me your notes. Can I just take them home, like copy them, and I and I just go to the office, and I just copy them on the copy. Like hey, I'd be like hey, hey, look, I have a problem listening in class, and they let me copy. <laughs> well done. And I didn't make it, but I, obviously. Was that I walking? Were there notes in walking? That was not walking class. What no. was the walking? There was class? an exercise class too. So, so in the <laughs> one semester, an exercise class and a walking class. Yeah, and then I had an English class, and that was the one. And I mean, like, my wife rips on me all the time for it because she really did like write all my papers in that too. Like, I'd be like, Jess, I really need your help. One, she's a phenomenal writer, and two, this is a crazy stat about my wife that I learned. And if I wouldn't known this before, stat I married of the day. her, I probably would have. Stepped away. <laughs> she never missed a day of school. Oh, oh yeah. From oh, elementary yeah. all the way through high school. That makes me think way less of Jess. Is that, crazy. Is that not insane, it's though? Insane. Like, That's how disgusting. do you How do you go into elementary? I mean, like, oh. I would fake six so oh, many times. so often. So many times. Get this. I really hope Get my mom. this. Yes. Now, <laughs> Lakeland one day, we got called. She had rosy cheeks. They sent her home. Well, she, like after I would have been after being recess, on the playground. So yeah, after recess, imagine, like, like she had Rosie. I'm knowing, like, knowing that stuff. Are you kidding me? Knowing that stuff, I would went in the bathroom and just <laughs> yeah, start smacking right. myself yeah. in the face. God, God, God. So when I was in elementary school, I had IBS. I still think I do. <laughs> 
imagine on the playground? <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> What's that off of Pineapple Express where he wanted to create bathrooms for kids on the playground? That's what dude. He, and that was I mean, septic evangelism. Septic like, tanks yeah, for septic kids. Tank, for uh, kids who got IBS in the playground. <laughs> Scott's losing his mind. Imagine Angelo in the I back. I love that we're laughing at Angelo has IBS. <laughs> I, oh, sorry. I, Anybody yeah, I had to go so often. Like, it would... There were some days where I would be like in the bathroom for most of the first few. Like, classes, hey, what are you doing like, in there? <laughs> you doing? Leave me alone. Yeah. I call my mom. I'm like, the IBS just, kid. Can I just? I go to the nurse and like they'd be like, "What's going on?" I'm like, "I can't get out of the bathroom." And they like they think like, <laughs> you're "Oh, like it. I went." Or you're like, just nervous. I'm you like, left no. your mommy. Yeah, no, <laughs> yeah, probably was it. And I was like, "No, I've been in the bathroom." So many times, and I like I had to call my mom, and she knew that I had this issue, so she would pick me up, and I just would go home, and I'd just sit on the toilet for the rest of the day. See, I had at least, at least at least once day. a year. I never went anywhere, went to the bathroom anywhere, anywhere but home, but home, yeah, and that, and I didn't, on butt yeah. until like high school. I didn't like yeah. to. And when that we was would go to thing. Michigan. It was, <laughs> I think maybe your house because yeah. I would stay at their house. Anytime we go to Michigan, I yeah. stay at their house or my grandma's house. That was it. There was like three places that I would go. Other I think than most that, kids are like that, though. I was like I remember, petrified, I, I, and I'd get completely naked. <laughs> Still okay, do that I'd part. Be, I'd be so like, too. Yeah, well, I like, didn't want to get poop on my shirt. You know, like, Rich, it's a urinal. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's rice. Yeah, it just, oh, man. just like butter. Hey, wait till <laughs> wait till you got to take Ford to a urine, public urinal. Can't wait. First of all, <laughs> first of all, I'm like, hey, use the short one. And he's yeah, like, no, I want to use the big favorite. one because he can launch. But I'm like, hey, <laughs> yeah. you can't touch. Don't touch don't the touch urinal, it, yeah. especially with. <laughs> yeah, you, every, you don't yeah. don't do that, you know. Kids so touch and then also dude. we go to we go to, we go to an Angels game, and it's the public urinal. Oh, it's the long trough. Yeah, the trough. <laughs> that's the that's the, Trice, the one where everybody Trice walks just, up, pulls it out, goes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey man. And so yeah. next time I was like, bro. He's like, what are you here All right, for? Here's the deal. Next time you go to the bathroom, blinders straight up. Just look straight up. <laughs> so the next time we walk in, he drops his pants, goes. <laughs> just like straight up i was like dude you don't do that this is like there's he's like why and i'm like because you just don't do just, it yeah, man you just like it. And, yeah. I remember how jess was like com- convinced that men go in and just like yeah sh- like, yeah yeah, like, yeah. Compare. I, that's another, yeah. That's another, we had this conversation with jess we're like no like it's, it's the exact dude, the urinal opposite. etiquette yeah. i don't want to compare no <laughs> <laughs> i don't want to know yeah. i do not yeah Emphasis can i go to a that. stall you got yeah. a stall open yeah i got rich naked next to me <laughs> there's like there's etiquette that there's, <laughs> there's, there's, there's somebody the angelo's in the bathroom for 24 hours and i just want to get in there like naked take it in the urinal yeah it's like there's there's etiquette where you walk in and if there's three urinals <laughs> you you don't go if somebody's in the middle one. You even let them finish. You yeah. go to like the urinals on the outside, but if, you wait till they're done. If like, you, you need to like, have one urinal, yeah, I know you're about to say the well, same thing well, I'm going to say. Maybe because like for like some reason they're like, and I don't want to say this to like make anybody upset, but the older generation for some reason doesn't sometimes understand no. that because there's be yeah. sometimes like I'll like go to the bathroom. You there's go up open to urinal to next. Yeah, to you? there's there's plenty of them. All of a sudden, right up next to me. Yeah, sitting there, I'm like, all right, calm down. Especially if there's no <laughs> walls. <laughs> calm down. Yeah. Especially if there's no walls. It's like you're at a sporting yeah. event. And there's like you know there's yeah, urinals yeah, yeah, everywhere yeah. and yeah. urine one yeah. and there's and the guy urine stands one. right next to you. Urine like, one. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's like, come on, man. Like really? Yeah, and then Trice had to get him where he doesn't take his pants all the way to his ankles too. <laughs> yeah, I'm that, like, bro, don't. Hey, you just all you gotta do now is like when he was little. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, like, when you, you get to school, you, you want to try to hold the shirt to up hey, too. <laughs> but yeah, like I'm like <laughs> things you don't think of when yeah. you're parenting, you know? Yeah, like yeah. I remember the kids because. I'm sure you guys remember kids at like third or fourth grade who still pull their pants down to their ankles and pee in the <laughs> urinal. And you're like, dude, and there's a couple kids I could name them to this day. I still, I know them. And I'm like, dude, that's remember, remember, remember ass, you. Huh? Yeah. 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 I remember working like you're SAC, not going anywhere. I worked after school and you'd have to like yeah. sometimes go in and make sure kids yeah. weren't, you know, messing around in the bathroom and like destroying Angelo. things. You'd walk in <laughs> yeah. and, and pants would be at their ankles. Like, yeah. oh, yeah, like, I, okay, can't, I can't, I can't do this. <laughs> I can't do this. Yeah. So many kids did that for so long. It's so weird. Yeah, I know at least two kids. I remember like being in school, and I like would have to go, and I, you know, Angelo would just go. But for me, I would sit there and I just start sweating. And I just oh, you know, yeah. you start like moving. Then all of a sudden, your stomach starts making the noises, and everybody's you looking around. Noises. You're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and, you're, and then yeah, yeah not random. Like, like ask a question. It's like quiet yeah. reading time or something. You're <laughs> like your stomach is just making yeah. all. Or when they noises. wouldn't let you go to the bathroom. Oh like, you don't yeah, have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, like the hell yeah. I don't. <laughs> you're just, I'm sweating. I freaking. <laughs> Uh, it's seeping out of my pants. Uh, I know. I'd be I'd be sitting there, and then you know, like you get off the bus. And I remember it was that hundred meter sprint. Oh yeah, the house. 
You know, I'm like, I'm getting in there. <laughs> what? The, Go ahead. The first time <laughs> I ever had a protein shake, I remember this. I was at I was at school and like I, my, how old were you? You start there. I don't know. I was in middle school. Like my brother yeah. started working out and he got some protein powder and I took yeah. some and I was like, dude, I thought this, I thought it was cool. And so I took some of it and obviously there's more protein than my body was nor- that it used to. So I had, to <laughs> and I was at school and Naturally. my brother picked me up from school and I go, Hey, we, we got to go home now. Like we got to go home now. And no, understand. <laughs> and he's like messing with me. And I, I've that to this day, it's the closest I've ever been to my pants and not actually doing it. Because I mean, I have such a bad. Pants, that's actually it's, it's such a one. Worst, it's a horrible feeling. feeling. He's like hitting the brakes, like kind of <laughs> being an, being an ass to me, and I'm like, dude, stop. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna. You heard about Billings hard. drinking two Olipops and not knowing they had, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know how they have like nine grams of fiber no in them? Way. Yeah. Oh yeah. He he was he. So I took a drink of mine, and then um, gotcha. like. Two minutes later, I go to pick the can up, and it's gone. I'm like, oh, what the no. hell? Billings drank all of it. Well, then I had another one because I didn't have any of the first one, and Billings is just does the same thing. And I looked at him. I'm like, dude, did you drink two of those? He's like, yeah. <laughs> That's not a good idea. It went, it went right sure through Sure enough, me. he said uh, he barely made it home. Too. Walking up the stairs was a chore. Chore. Yeah, dude. Those things will run through you. It's like things like that that will just haunt you like for like the rest of your life. Yeah, you you're know, like, like, I don't want to see another lollipop. Like number here. Sorry. Oh, yeah, we're. I didn't know. I remember, you know, too, and I mean, like, heaven, I mean, like, heaven forbid, you start dating too, and like you're at like oh. their house, and you're like, oh my god, come on, this could not be happening. The farts are the <laughs> you're worst. Like, I planned you're this. The farts, the whole, <laughs> whole night. The farts. Yeah. 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 I, 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 with my IBS, I. Had to <laughs> I don't think did I. You I don't like think answer, did you answer the door like that? <laughs> Hi, I'm Angelo. I have IBS. <laughs> my, my name's Angelo. I, mean, and I have IBS. Yeah, I'm here to date your daughter. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, Madison. Can I may. check out your bathroom first? <laughs> What's your plumbing situation? Yeah. Septic or sewer? <laughs> I brought my own toilet. That paper. was also like a very like underrated man. I, I feel like this is you know getting crazy with it, but it's like, dude, go ahead. I I appreciate a toilet with a good strong flush. Mm. Oh. Like, there's nothing worse dude. than the water that just fills up. Do you and remember the one that down? You're like, yeah, you're sure like, I am not going right. No. Here. <laughs> I can't. That's why I was terrified. I think I one time like one overflowed or yeah. something. Yeah, oh. like, no, never again. <laughs> and what do you do? I mean, there's no plunger. There's no just one around. Run you away. Just get run out of home. there. Yeah. You know, and you got to wait till no one's in there. So you're like, you're waiting. Do you remember the ones at the ACC like, that here. sounded like a tiger was in the... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like you, you would go, those? you would go, you wouldn't even be done. And, and you're like, <laughs> it would hit and it's like, oh my gosh, I got more. You're sucking yeah. you in. It's like the yeah. uh, airplane toilets. So you're like, I, yeah. yeah, it was, I, it was I call, crazy. I call it the industrial flush. Mm-hmm. So yeah. whenever like, whenever you... You hit it and you're like, oh, dude, that's going to be ah, good. That's a good one. Yeah. I love those. Yeah. Do you use a squatty potty? Yeah. Yeah, me oh, too. Yeah. You still do? Oh, I love it. You still on? I, yeah. I don't know. My toilets at my house are so tall. Oh, they that's the worst. So you, feel like, you feel like a kid I'm like, like kicking your feet on the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I mean, I am on my tippy toes. Going, it's like a bar are, stool. How do kids even do that? <laughs> you know, know, like, you I'm are not, on your tippy toes now? Yes. They're huge. They're who huge. is living in your house, Shaq? <laughs> Goliath. Yeah, Dude, like, I don't know who who picked uh, these toilets uh, out. Philistines. Like, if you don't if you don't have a squatty potty, do you can't go. It like pinches it off. Yeah. It's like I love such a squatty potty, position. man. I feel so much better, more efficient. It's so much. Better. I can't understand. Like thinking about that though. Now I never really thought about that. But I'm like my kids, like Violet, she's still like kicking the kicking, you know, like the, kicking. kicking. And no how way. Do you do that? And that's Angelo. It's yeah, Angelo. that's me in my house. <laughs> ding ding ding. It's ding. Like the most giant toilet. Yeah. That's me in my house. Dude, Are so you sure you're not when, going like in the tub? When we went to you're Shanghai, using the thing. When we went to Shanghai, is that where we went? Mm-hmm. Shanghai? And, where were we in China? Oh yeah, just a hole the in the day. Ground. No, that was Korea. Pushed the wrong button. Didn't realize it. My anyway, apologies. You think water fountain? No, jet stream. But anyway, yeah. No, in China, oh. it was like you know everybody's like, oh yeah, it's just a hole. No, it was a oh. porcelain hole. Like it was like they weren't saving any money. Because it was a giant, like it had two treads They're on either your side. Saving your mobility, though. Do what? They're saving your mobility. Yeah, though. Too, touche. But yeah, I never yeah, had yeah. to poop, and I wanted to try it at the place. But no. Did you have like? Well, did you have in a the bathroom in your hotel? Toilet. Yeah, but yeah. like, um, I just like I, I like feel like you'd be places sitting. Were holes. I, I feel like I'd be going like a V up. <laughs> like I'd be like this, you know. <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, <laughs> we now like, that we've elk hunted a bunch and not had a toilet, you can figure it out, like, how you got to... But you almost have to, like, find a tree to lean against. Yeah. <laughs> um, Grab a hold of something squat. and give it Yeah, help. because you can't just squat, because, or else you have to take your pants off and get naked. Oh, you know? yeah. you don't, you don't Naturally. Naturally. Luke. <laughs> I remember... Yeah. 
<laughs> Luke's pooping. Negative ten uh, out. Rich is naked. <laughs> his pooping etiquette at, at at elk camp is not good. Uh, no. Luke. No, Luke. Luke. The first the first okay. night. So so <laughs> Scott knows. So everybody else is probably Scott, Scott, heard you these were stories. There. We have a five gallon <laughs> bucket that the hole is cut out of it at the bottom. You carry the bucket. You dig a hole. Do your business. Yeah, there's a shovel. We have, have, a, shovel. have a shovel. And mm-hmm. it has a toilet paper on the... Like, it's it's a really efficient... And it's me and nice. Scott race every morning for the bucket. Last year, luckily, we had two buckets. Like, one of us would get up. Yeah, and when like, you guys look at each other and you start out. getting dressed as fast yeah. as you can. And you run out and try to grab the bucket, right? Yeah. And so you sit on the bucket, do your business, cover your hole. You try to go, like, 100 yeah, yards away from go camp, out. you know, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Man, that's a one far morning, walk. One morning, we all wake up and... Somebody had taken a dump if I five, if, five yeah. feet from the, the cafeteria. We had a tent that was like where I everybody wish people eats. could see it. Like if this is so this is the, the camper that some people are staying in. Yep. Here is the, the meal tent and here's a shit right here. And I'm talking the walkway is like the person's you know, shoulder, cooking eggs. Right? There's like a shoulder <laughs> width distance to walk between the food tent and the sleep tent. And no toilet through, paper on the shit either. No. We go we And it's go, not we, dug in a hole. Nope. Oh, totally and it's cover a, up your mess. It's a big <laughs> too. It's a it's a good like it's, it's an first, IBS. It's the first one he'd probably had since we you know you know you get in the airplane it kind of screws you up. Yeah, so yeah, probably yeah. like thirty six hours yeah. or something like it was a big like one. a cow pie. Yeah, <laughs> just <out. laughs> Scott right. It was a big one. <laughs> Answer me, Scott. Scott can yeah. attest to this. Yeah, and it was oh. Luke. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, it was Matt, and it was. I mean, you could have accidentally walked through it. Easily. Especially, you have to Easily. And it was right next to the food tent. Right next to right, it. Right, and people are Ten walking feet, around maybe we, we get eat. up before the sun is up. Yep. So you're walking around. You just expect that there's not going to be something like that on the ground. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Imagine yeah. the yeah. first yeah. thing you do in the morning. Because yeah. usually you wake up there's and it's pitch here. black and you just see a headlamp yeah. out in the woods. You're like, like yeah, it, yeah. And you're like, oh, somebody's <laughs> pooping. <laughs> and it's like coming up and down, you know. Have you heard my story about the, the bacon? Scott? No. We shared the bacon. Yeah, yeah. So, so, um, duds, duds went. Okay, so we had shot, I had shot a grouse and another animal, and <laughs> it wasn't an animal. <laughs> Just keep going with the grouse. Just go with the grouse. Shot shot a, the and grouse. then an animal. <laughs> I had shot a grouse, and it's like you know what a grouse is yes. like a chicken, yes. and it was pretty good. The grouse, grouse is pretty good. Is, grouse is a delicious animal. I have a weak stomach, obviously. No way. <laughs> I, yes. I, yeah. And so I think we've already duds, crossed that bridge. Duds goes and fishes with Brian. Hold on. The preparation. Who's, who's, who's prep, Duds? Just Jeff Dodds. He's one of Dodds. our buddies. He's, Jeff Dodds. We call him Duds sometimes. <laughs> Brian calls him Duds because it makes him mad. <laughs> and so what you usually do is you fry up a little bacon, get the bacon grease in there, and then chuck the, the grouse in there and, yeah. and fry it in a pan, right? Yep. Go ahead. So, on it. so what? I'm setting the scene. Um, like you've had, like you've yeah. had, like bacon wrapped, whatever. So we wanted to yes. bacon wrap it, and uh, so we asked him if he could. They went fishing. They were coming back up. They were going to stop at like you know some little store or whatever. And I said, "Hey, can you grab some bacon." They did. They grabbed the bacon. I didn't think anything of it. I take the bacon. I wrap it up, and um, I didn't realize at the time the bacon was in a cooler. So you're like, ah, cool, whatever. The cooler had no ice in it, so it had been just been sitting in his truck all day. <laughs> Like so an oven, smelling cooler too. it's just an oven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got <laughs> fish blood all over it because they've been fishing in it. You know, it's just <laughs> this, it's this little Yeti cooler with no ice in it. And so they bring it up there. I go, oh yeah, here's some bacon. Whatever, I wrap it up and I eat it. Scott, it was pretty good. And dude, one a.m. hits and Angelo I think I'm gonna throw stops, up. Like, or like you can, well, because the camper's great, <laughs> yeah. except for when people start moving around and in and out. Is that the and one that's out there? <clears throat> yeah. That's, okay. Yeah, I'm yeah. on and I'm on the top, top bunk. bunk. Adjacent him, so he's oh. here and I'm here. And I had gotten up and I was like, I can get through this. And you know that feeling when you're gonna throw up? You like your mouth is yeah, watering, yeah, you're watering, sweating. Yeah, you got the spits coming. I'm like, I'm just you know sitting there trying to breathe through it, and it goes away. And immediately when it goes away, now I have to shit. And I'm like, okay, I have to get up. And I jump out of bed and rich, I wake Rich up, and he goes, What just happened? And I go, I just got. <laughs> He goes, oh, I thought you fell. Yeah, because I thought he fell off the damn. He's like, Rich, where's the headlamp? Bunk. <laughs> so I run out there, and it's like thirty degrees. And I run out there, and I, you know, I did. Oh, a super hole. clear though, beautiful night. It was, yeah, yeah. it was a fine night, the best <laughs> night for it. And it, <laughs> I'm, I'm glad it was cold because I get out of the camper, and like it's just warm in the camper. It's not bad. I get out, and it's just so cold. And you know, I've been sweating because I've, I have the, I have the. Sh- 
And so I yes. go out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. 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 No, this, is just, this, this is just normal. <laughs> I go out. Sounds and, you like know, a I'm normal s- Tuesday for you. <laughs> I'm, s- I'm sitting on the bucket for probably 30 minutes or an hour, just like wait until it hits me again. Feet are dangling. Again. Yep. No. Just to feel at home. <laughs> and Joe's got his seven foot tall bucket. 55 gallon <laughs> drum. Yeah. He goes, just makes You're me feel it up. <laughs> Let me climb this tree to sit on my bucket. <laughs> it was awful. He wouldn't go, needless to say, he didn't go hunt the next morning. It was awful. The bucket yeah. is awesome. Billings <laughs> shouldn't ate that said grouse. It, said it bruised his butt cheeks. Yeah. So he wanted to. He put. He cut pieces Manzanus of cardboard. Is coddled. Cut yeah. pieces right. of cardboard to sit on the edges of. <laughs> It's so good. It's so like, the best part too got about the grouse feathers on it. About elk camp is like in the beginning of the week when you get up to piss or something, you like walk out and around. Mm. And by the end of it last year, it was raining. People would just stand at the door and just piss outside the door. Because <laughs> yeah. it was it would be raining. You're like, yeah. I'm not getting out. Yeah. Or the first year, it got so cold that you would pee in a bottle because you you wouldn't get up, and you would set the bottle on the outside, <laughs> of like just just next to you in the. Yeah, the trailer it would freeze by the the morning. See now that's oh that, yeah God. that's that's cold, crazy. So that is cold. crazy. Like there's there's cold and then there's that kind of cold. Yeah. Like I I wanted to I I had a story that I wanted to say. I'm gonna have to circle back to the urinal real quick. <laughs> <laughs> so I was at the airport <laughs> the other day and this dad's in there and he's got like two or three of his kids. I can't remember. But that's the worst. When yeah, you have multiple say, yeah, of them, yeah, like, don't yeah, touch yeah. that. Don't do yeah. that. Don't yeah, do that. And man. it was his worst nightmare. Oh, I, can, yeah. I can, I can, I saw it happening and he's going pee <laughs> and his kid is peeing in like the short one or whatever. And he's like playing in the urinal. Ugh. Like he's like, like, he's like, well, first he's like holding it. Like he's leaning up against his whole cake stir, whatever. He goes to pull his pants up. And as he's pulling his pants up, he slides, you know, there's, Piss, yeah. you know, splatter all over. Yep. He slides That's on the, the floor, Been puts there. his hands in the urinal. <laughs> he's like, oh, God. Falls, <laughs> falls down and, like, <laughs> slides onto the ground. And he's, like, picking himself up. And then he's, like, kind of, like, putting his stuff back on. <laughs> and he's, like, <laughs> and he's, like, <laughs> he's like, like, oh, no. Oh my Christ, God. Christ at Chipotle. He's, like, hey, I got to go to the bathroom, What are you doing Dad. this whole time? <laughs> I'm waiting for you. <laughs> Trice at Chipotle one Angel's time. Angel's, like, I got next. <laughs> I got <laughs> comes hey. running out of the bathroom after I let him go. Sleeve oh. soaked. Oh. I'm like, what oh. happened? He goes, I slipped. <laughs> Fell right in the toilet. Oh. I'm like, oh, dude. Such a trice thing. Did you guys, I don't know if this ever happened to anybody else. Have you ever dropped something in the toilet oh my God. and have to get it My out? phone. My phone. I, I did it the other day. I, for some reason, whenever I got to pee, I, yes. I got to watch a dang YouTube video. <laughs> <It's or something. laughs> like, I'm just sitting there, you know, and I'm like peeing. Was and there, of course, there was pee in it, 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 ha- it happened. Like, it's this stupid case. It went like this. Like, it opened. I go, oh, no. <laughs> and, I'm, and I'm still peeing as it's in there because I can't stop. I can't um, stop. I can't stop when it like, the whole time, It stings. The whole time. I, and this is like 11 o'clock at night. I go, dude, I dropped this in the toilet. Jess going to wake up. She's going to see me pissing on my phone. And then it's going to be this big order deal and I got to explain myself. But anywho, <laughs> Why's my phone still like this? <laughs> but anywho, like as I'm peeing, because I, I'm still going, I'm thinking in my head. You didn't just grab it right then? No, no, no. no because you, the whole, you let it marinate in there? Dude, the whole time I'm peeing and I'm, uh, in, in my head, I'm like, I got to grab this phone after I'm done peeing. And I'm saying it to myself, <laughs> well, why am I talking about it? Why won't I just grab it? And I get done and yeah. I just had to. Oh, that case? Yeah. I washed it. <laughs> it's leather. Yeah. There's no way it's totally clean. What are you talking about? It's pleather. It's sanitary <laughs> to me. It's different. Oh. Yeah, what are you talking about? Like, I was more talking about <laughs> so, like when you were a kid. <laughs> I was more. We didn't have phones when we were kids. No, we were pissing. Not talking about phone, My like, damn game like boy. ball or something. Like, you're playing like with a ball or, or, or maybe you're bouncing something and it goes in the toilet. Dude, anytime it would happen, my parents would be like, well, you got to get it. And I would have a total meltdown. I'm like, I don't want to put my hand in the toilet. <laughs> and it's like, you know, I just, I have a very vivid memory of like almost my whole family just standing over me. And they're like, get it out of the toilet. And I'm like, I don't want to. It's and so Joe, cool. Oh, and, no, it wasn't Grab that toy. <laughs> yelled at me. Oh. Like, get it out of there. <laughs> like, I don't want to. It's disgusting. <laughs> one of my, one of my friend's brothers had a, had a problem like where like he like like he wouldn't go for like a long time you know and so like when he did go it was it it, it was it was it was honestly something to see Mm -hmm. like people would travel around (laughs) to see it but but they would (laughs) they they would leave plastic knives in the bathroom oh (laughs) no holy cow that big (laughs) chop it up so it flushed better (laughs) 
what is going on here? I came over to visit. And I'm like, why the hell is there a oh, like, in the <laughs> Like, where are the napkins? Or, like, oh, over. my gosh. He goes, dude, he, goes, he goes, dude, like, my brother has this problem. Oh, man. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> in there, got a napkin. In it. Right. <laughs> gotta get in there. <laughs> yeah. He's like sharpening. <laughs> I got used to cut code today. Uh, cut code. Yeah. That was your former profession. Uh, Darren used to sell. When Darren moved down here, I had door to. Door my friend's brother needed me. Cut code no, no, knives. Door to door. Door. I sold to my grandma. <laughs> I sold. I think one to my aunt. <laughs> that was it, dude. One time I was so upset. <laughs> my, one time in my old neighborhood. We had a guy walking around selling knives like that, and someone called <laughs> the cops. Someone called the cops, and mm. that, that someone was <laughs> running around with with knives. Uh, my parents, yeah. my parents, you yeah. know, we were outside playing. And my my parents were like, hey, get in here, get in here, and they pull me in. They go, there's a guy you know, walking around with knives. And then get that he thing like, out of the toilet. <laughs> like you see him, like go to the next house. He's got like a briefcase, like showing that. <laughs> it's like just a guy selling knives. And someone, some old lady, had called. The cops are like circling our neighborhood. And I'm like, what's going on? Nice. This guy selling knives. They thought it was some. It was Darren? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Darren yeah. selling it was knives. Darren selling yeah. Cut coats. Yeah, I was stuttering to you. <laughs> <laughs> Buy my knives. <laughs> I'm gonna... no. Just come on, man. I need to pay for these four classes. <laughs> the only reason CrossFit Mayhem exists is because Darren had to get a job, and we couldn't find him a job. <laughs> <laughs> my first six months, man, I, I didn't make any money. I lost all my money. Darren's mom's Fine. like, he can move down there. He needs a job. But he has to get a job. <laughs> We're like, all right, we'll find him a job. <laughs> couldn't find him a job. I remember at, at one point, Rich took me to Sonic. I go, Rich, I moved all the way down here to work at Sonic. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> he goes, just go in and get an application. <laughs> So it's like it's like, like you're on unemployment. Right. You have to have an application every month to show that you're trying. Yeah, and again, like that there's nothing it. there's that nothing wrong with working on Sonic, but it's like I worked at McDonald's. It's like I left I left. That's I a left lateral move. move. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I, I really don't feel like I'm moving up here. You know, I don't have roller skates or something. Yeah. I, I, I can't. Yeah, be I'm not good on people. roller skates. Yeah. yeah, so we were like, all right, let's just start, start a gym. <laughs> start a gym, and you're gonna you're you're gonna sleep in this place. You're gonna stay here all day. <laughs> no, no, God. let's let's turn the uh, CrossFit model on its head and, you know, instead of just having classes, it's going to be a, you know, 24 hours. Open door. For open open yeah. door. We had this whiteboard and it was just like, all right, who might show up at this time? And somebody would walk in and be like, oh, yeah. Yeah, here it is. Be working them out and all of a sudden somebody would walk in 10 minutes later, like, now what do I do? <laughs> we got two bars. Oh, that's yeah. so funny. You wait. Yeah. I was talking to uh, uh, to a Dusty um, oh yeah, Dusty you know, Hill. Yeah, yep. I would say because Dusty Hill, Rich is uh, that was a motocross was, group. Yep, was one of our first. Hillary's cousin. <laughs> Hillary's cousin. Okay, Mar married in. Yeah, but Dusty's anywho, my cousin. Yeah. But um, he was telling me so his first workout was the modified Cindy, where he'd have everybody do like the ten, 10 minutes. minutes of Cindy. Yeah, yeah, yep. yeah. Well, the warm up I gave him was Cindy. <laughs> so I had him do, I had him warm up with pull-ups, push-ups. Hey, it's a good warm up. And I was like, yeah. well, yeah, I mean, if you want to go out and shoot a gun, you're going to practice shooting a gun, right? <laughs> yeah, you're not going to yeah. go out there, you know, and just throw rocks. <laughs> but I was just thinking about that. I go, wow, that's actually how I warm people up. Do you remember how, like, well, do you remember Patty came, my mother-in-law, and she, <laughs> we gave her the warm up. Remember she broke the door too? Yep. The rower, so the she sits on the afraid. rower. Yeah, she couldn't figure out how to open the door. So she just pushed it open with the pole. <laughs> and then she, on the rower, didn't realize that it would, wouldn't would catch you and just falls off the back of the door. Oh, rower. my God. And it, was, and it was like a slow motion fall. It wasn't like one of those like, you yeah, know, it was she like, kept uh, going. <laughs> and then she did, I think it was like three rounds of maybe like a row, a 200 row. Yeah, and like. I don't know, maybe like an inch, like some inchworms, inchworms or whatever. Or something. She went to go to the bathroom and just left. Yeah. We got home later and she's like, oh, I thought that was the workout. <laughs> it was just <laughs> a warm like, up. Man, I'm sore. <laughs> yeah. I was like, well, there you go. We'll and get then you the, the time uh, you gave Allie Rabdo, my sister-in-law. Love that. But then she thought that she went to a doctor and they told her she had tore both, torn both of her triceps. Oh my god! There's no way you've torn yeah. your triceps doing. We 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 never really advertised any of this out at no, the no, time. No, no, no. I was like, no, she's okay. She's fine. She, yeah, yeah, she's fine. Yeah, that's actually genetic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. some people are genetically well, predisposed. It to happens. Get it happens. Mm -hmm. It happens around the the yeah. exact time it happened to it's you. It's a form of IBS. Yeah, or the, <laughs> or the time okay. Darren could, took so. In the beginning, we didn't make any money. <laughs> we barely made enough yeah, money. This, I, this I one's actually up there to this pay for the loan. For the equipment that we bought. We took out a loan for like seven grand, I think. Yeah. For equipment. Yeah. And it was 
it wasn't the brightest idea. Luckily, we had some friends that gave us or allowed us to like work out of their facility for free. Yeah. Uh, thanks, yeah, Rob and Kevin. Say like and your dad like made the pull up made the pull up bar stuff. and all that stuff. But we had to buy barbells, plates, GHDs. Yeah, yeah. Rowers. What else? Remember we first got the GHDs and we did like 100 GHDs Every day. and we were sore. We were sore forever. Like we're Remember like, Remember the wow. warm up we used to do was like three rounds of 10 of everything? Yeah, there was like 20 movements. <laughs> There's 20 movements and no joke. We'd go through it three times, like 10 of everything, like strict handstand push-ups and stuff. And we're doing handstand that. walk 50 <laughs> we, feet. Yeah, and yeah. then we threw the obstacle in there because it was like a gymnastics yeah. cheerleading place. So they yeah. had the oh, yeah. wedge. Yeah. We would handstand walk on that. We'd, we'd handstand walk. We'd do all that stuff. And yeah, it would literally take us an hour to go through this warm up. It'd be like the whole <laughs> workout. Have, yeah. Be like, Rich, I really don't want to work out now. <laughs> I'm but, exhausted. Well, yeah. But so know. anyway, we had this loan for $7,000 that we had to pay on. And that was the only, we were barely making enough money for that. <laughs> Darren was stuck there all day. I was working intramurals. Yeah. Uh, Dave was at a- or Averett all day, wouldn't, yep. wouldn't, wasn't there. And so it was just Darren basically just hanging out. Me and Facebook. <laughs> found a lot of YouTube videos. Yeah, found early a lot on of YouTube. YouTube. Yeah, you were early, early YouTube. Gosh, and so Darren wants to go visit home one time. Oh, yeah. And so he, to visit Jess, I think that was when they first started dating. Yeah. Darren takes the card, the debit card. We don't have any money in there. <laughs> I didn't have any money. <laughs> and Darren gets a hotel room. Got a hotel gets, room. Buys I was living, food I was popping champagne every- bottles. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wow, rock star. <laughs> yeah, we <laughs> barely, is, that month is- we barely made the note for the, uh, I think it was like 200 bucks or something. <laughs> like. I was like, this is what real debt feels like. <laughs> yeah. Like, I love Different goals require different nutrition. For years, I felt best when intermittent fasting. But in the thick of games training, I began adding in breakfast, and now mountain biking is requiring to increase calories again. RP Strength and the RP Diet app guided my nutrition every time. RP Strength provides a year of nutrition guidance for $89.99. That's less than $8 a month. www.rp.app forward slash code forward slash froning for a year of RP Strength for only $89.99. So yeah, so Darren used to just <laughs> hang out, <laughs> what what? The? be on the computer. Yeah. Yeah. And then a lot. Um, it was like first time I had internet too. So yeah. it's like, you know, I grew, I grew up like without internet. So like that was like automate. Oh, yeah. yeah. His mom wouldn't ever get internet we, at the house. Yeah. We like just now got it. Oh, do really? Yeah. Just now? Like my parents still have a lock on the TV. So like when I like come home and stuff, I can't watch like a PG-13. <laughs> it's like you got channel one through four. I was like, mom, this movie just has animal violence in it. For God's sake, let me, yeah. Yeah. let me watch this movie. Let me watch this movie. I'm it's 31. not Geo, you know? I'm 31, I promise. <laughs> I was I was uh, talking to Sam and Zoe. I was explaining to them like how, like when I started, like what we would normally do, I would usually come in. It was like 8 o'clock. You were coaching 815, and I would just hang. This like, is more professionalized, out. though. Yo, yeah, yeah, This yeah, was yeah, back. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm talking yeah. Wild no, West. I'm, yeah, when Darren would be <laughs> playing Call of Duty, and he'd be like, hey, yeah, good squat over there. Hey. <laughs> Get warmed up with the five pull-ups, 10 push-ups, 15 air squats, and we'll run. 20 minutes, and then, yeah, then 20 minutes. <laughs> let me, let me yeah, finish no, this I'm, kill streak. Yeah. Yeah, hold on. I got I, I got dogs right now. I got eyes in the sky. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm jumping forward like three or four years now. Yeah, that's when I sat behind a desk. Yeah, probably four that. years. Walked, yeah, this is 2012. This is, uh, 2012, this is over next to Ralph's. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Cedar? Yeah, on 41 Cedar. Cedar. What was it? 42? 41 South Cedar? 41 South Cedar. Uh, South Cedar. Oh, yeah, right it's right gone now. Yeah, we're, next, yeah, we're, we're now. right next to Laser Tag. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> and... I would I would come in and like you would be coaching and sometimes like maybe I would do the A fifteen. But this, this is when is, we did classes too, though. Yeah, this yeah. is the, this we're, we're professional. Yeah, you actually had a sign. This in. is pretty professional and <laughs> like so I would come in and, and I would hang out. It would be like you and Ben and maybe Fanny would still be there. This is like before Jake, yeah, probably. Jake. Jake would maybe be there. Ben uh, Rogers, yeah, Todd. and then you, and yeah, you you Our would classes roll in. We're all coaches. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That was, and that then was our and then we would watch, no, we'd we watch YouTube, money, yeah, yeah, YouTube or whatever was on the Yahoo page. Yep. It was the Yahoo. Oh page yeah, we watched, always go through the Yahoo. Oh, watch the Yahoo page favorite. for like an hour, thirty minutes, an hour. Or so yep. and two then, hours. And then we get a football out or something, and then <laughs> or the dr- or the agility, we, we agility ladder, ladder for agility a while, ladder. and then and then I was like, yeah, handstand walk ladder. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, and then well, and then we the. We evolved to the hands, the freestanding handstand push up competition. Oh, that was awful. Gosh, dude, that was a neck breaker, too. <laughs> yeah. yeah uh, we spent I think a lot of time Todd, Todd got like, I think Todd got 21, and then I think maybe you got 24 or 25 after yeah. like a couple weeks. Weeks. And like, because Todd had this, the high score. This forever. is like a three hour. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And that's what I said. Yeah, and I go yeah. around like 11 or 11.30, we do our first workout. Do you remember like, <laughs> do you remember uh, 
going back to even like the older days too, like when like memberships were due, we're like, uh, no, no, this is what I was just thinking I, about this. So we'd be yeah. like, hey, uh, it's a hundred bucks. It'd be like, yeah. it'd be like Donovan or Jake. Thirty. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and we go, yeah, yeah, yeah sure, yeah, it's better I'm than like, nothing. Yeah. <laughs> we need people. I, yeah, no, I'm like rich. I mean, like, rich like one time like told me because like Rich and Dave would always like, <laughs> like hey, ask, Darren, like, if this is gonna be your job, yeah, you no, have you, to get members. And I would like go up to him and I like start walking up to him. Of course, like I'm sweating, you know. I'm like, oh, oh my god, I have to ask these people for money. And I, like, I would get up there, I'd be like. Yeah, are, you know, are you doing okay today, you know, and stuff? And they're like, oh, man, you know, the job was tough. I'm like, dude, I can't do this. I just walk away. I, 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 was, like, I, I was like, I can't do this. You know, they're like, I just had a kid, <laughs> you know, or something. Yeah, yeah. First, the first iteration of Mayhem was basically a frat house where we got really fit. You'd be like, hey, Johnson, you owe 100 bucks. All I got is 20. All right, that'll work. Yeah, Donovan were, would show up, they were do Linda. You for two months. He'd quit at round five, wouldn't come back for three weeks. Yep. And then he'd yeah, want to come back. Yep. He'd cramp up. Oh man! <laughs> yeah, that's, that, yeah. That's you remember a, those like early competition weekends we would do? We have like twenty five events. Yeah, you know, like <laughs> yeah, twenty. We, yeah. The one day we we ran, I think it was we did it was, a five. We yeah, froze. frozen. Yeah, because we came back. Was, my beard was just complete was icicles, freezing. Yeah. and then we yeah. just yeah, we would just get we got really like easy. We got really that fit. That, uh, that was a different one, but it was like me, oh, you, yeah, Johnson, uh, Kurt, Kurt. Who else would have been there? I guess like maybe Dave Fizz. Fizz was there. Yeah, Dusty. <laughs> Caleb. Uh, oh, D'Lo? No, no D'Lo might have been in there with yeah, us. Yeah, say we might have had a couple like. But yeah, there was, there was no, we weren't making any money no. whatsoever. No, I remember when I when I started the fire department and I was, you know, I was on shift with Kurt and he was talking about. The good old days? No, not no. necessarily, but like, you know, how pissed off he was. He was just so pissed off and like, because he's asking me questions about how the gym's doing and stuff. And I was like, yeah, well, you know, like we're doing this or whatever. And I was coaching often at this time. He's like, dude. When I would coach, he goes, you know what I got paid? He goes, I got paid McDoubles. He goes, I got paid McDoubles. <laughs> you got a free membership of McDoubles, yep. That's all, that's all that I like Kurt, remember. Kurt also too. scared away a lot of members. <laughs> oh, I'm that sure. was also I mean, like one of my favorite things, too. It's like, all right, lunchtime, and this is at like 9 a.m. <laughs> <And> like, <laughs> McDonald's, yeah, we go right to McDonald's. across 111. Yeah, yeah, we go to McDonald's, come back, you're like... You know, eleven o'clock. All right, lunch. You know, <laughs> Pat Sherwood. Yeah. Pat Sherwood got us hooked on the McDoubles because he gave the zone uh, uh, lecture at a level yeah, one, what's and he like he's like, this is a traditional breakfast, and he just put the macros from it, and then this is like, you know, which which one would you pick? It's and everybody's still one of my favorite. Yeah, examples, but it was though. like orange juice, granola, and fruit. And it, and it was all carbs. Yeah. And then this one, you like pulled the thing back and it was a McDouble. And you're like, yes. <laughs> Such a horrible nutrition yeah, lecture. It's horrible. <laughs> but great. It was. I mean, but it was because so. Because it ended up being it, more it, balanced. It like really gives a realistic like example yeah, of too. What of, yeah, modern, people can. Yeah. But it was funny. Yeah. And so, of course, we just started eating McDoubles eating left McDoubles. and right. Yeah, I was like a genius. Yeah, I was like, it's healthier than you we know, had a lot of banana. Peanut, we had a lot of peanut butter then <laughs> too. <laughs> <laughs> banana. Yeah, yeah. I just gave that up. I'm like, well, veggies gone, yeah, gone. Um, I had a triple cheeseburger last weekend. Did you really? Yeah, like, well, we were from McDonald's. Oh, they still do that. So, yeah. like, remember the other thing? We 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 would get the doubles too, and like that's like when we like cut out bread. So we just take the buns <laughs> off and put it in a bowl and like mix it up, or like or like <laughs> rich or, or like rich like we buy a pizza and we'd scrape the cheese and sauce and eat it. <laughs> I was like, this is I was like, this is ridiculous, man. <laughs> like I'd be crying eating it. Hey, low carb, like, go man. Back, I would go back and eat the crust. <laughs> like I would like we'd do it all. I'm like, God, dude, that's here. a lot. We go out to the dumpster. <laughs> back <laughs> Just like, uh, like, I'd be like, oh, my God, why? <laughs> we use knee sleeves and weight belts. Why wouldn't we have a tool to help us breathe better? For the last two years, the Airwave HIIT mouthpiece has been my recovery tool on the competition floor. But lately, I've been using the endurance mouthpiece. It has a more secure fit to keep your jaw relaxed and the airways open during long training sessions. For podcast listeners only, get 15% off at www.airwave.com forward slash froning. Do you remember the first day we did two workouts at Averett? We did a workout yeah. that morning. We watched a video and we we're like, "Hey, we one should of the try workouts that workout." I we did like Lynn five shoulder to overhead at one eighty five. It was Freddie's Revenge. Remember that's what they called it? it was five shoulder overhead at one eighty five and ten burpees. Yeah, because I couldn't do it. Yeah, you could. I remember Rich doing one eighty five. I'm like, Rich, I can't do that. <laughs> but that was the second workout of the day because yeah, we can't. did Lynn that morning. It was pull ups and bench max reps for yep. of each. Oh yeah, yeah. And so we finished and we were like, we're just kind of bored the rest of the day and we're on YouTube. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and we saw this workout. We're like, yeah, I, I think can, if we did a second workout, we would die. Good. You know, because <laughs> back then they were, I was you know, like, yeah, you I remember worst. watching 
Tony Budding on every second counts, and he's like, yeah. if you do two workouts a day, you could die. Because that's when they were like <laughs> hardcore three on one yeah. off. Do you remember yeah, we did t- 200 deadlifts at 135 <laughs> for time? 300. Was it 300? 300 deadlifts because I think Because like it Castro, came on the video. Yeah, because Castro was talking about yeah. it or like something like that. He said, yeah, they should be able to deadlift the bar three, 300 times like if I told him. Next day, we're in there, <laughs> cling, cling. For 300 I'm like, reps. Rich, I don't want to do this. <laughs> 300 reps. <laughs> like, yeah, I was like, I got class. What was what was the workout? The the five shoulder over 10 burpee? Is it yeah, just it's one a fri- round? No, 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 five, five rounds. Five rounds. Time. It was yeah, like Kalipa, And like back then, that's Dude, heavy. That's Dude, heavy. that's heavy. That's heavy yeah. now. Yeah. That's like still a be, nasty It'd be a workout. hard workout. Yeah, and it was like workout. the regular burpees. Yeah, there was, was no bar burpees. face. Yeah, yeah, it was just no clap behind your head. It was the old pop your hip up and, you know, whatever. Yeah, Do you remember like, my first semifinal, the burpee standard over the ab mat? Dude, that was the so stupidest. Ridiculous. Yeah, ever. you had to because you had to twenty five burpee had over the, ab mat, five hundred meter row, 20, two rounds, which two is rounds. a terrible workout. Yeah. Yeah. But the ab mat, you had to stand up. And then jump over. Yeah, you had and to so do like a no dolphin rep. pose I, at the time. I got no reps, like a thousand reps. I remember watching the video. I was so pissed. That was my worst finish at semifinals. I, I was, was like, so embarrassed. first, second, I'm whatever, like and then up to everybody. 15th or something like <laughs> that. He's, I'm like, he's the champ. Yeah, and he's, my guy. yeah he's, he's my guy. Yeah, he's my guy. He can do it. such a stupid standard. Yeah. That was back at the, uh, and remember at sectionals too, the break the vertical plane of the bar on the pull-up? Yeah. So you had to break. Yeah, you had to break over. this. And we can well, only butterfly. We 20, no. And we can only butterfly. Yeah, yeah, we can only. Yeah, what was we that? Didn't know how uh, to, that workout was called the core. Core, yeah. The Ron like and five then, rounds of 425 yeah, 400. pull-ups. Yeah, 25 kipping. Oh. Yeah. I know. And I remember, like, watching him do it. I was like, Rich, what's a kip? I was like, I don't, don't know how to kip. Do <laughs> yeah, that wasn't in our like warm-up. Frog butterfly kip. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that wasn't in our warm-up. No. Did you guys just go right to butterfly pull-ups? Yep. Really? Yep. Yeah. We I saw mean, we saw the coolest thing. Chris Spieler did it, and then you yeah, yeah, Chris I don't remember when we saw it. I don't remember. We, we yeah. used to do all of our muscle ups. I think it was like Mike G, too. though, was like one of the big names. Like Mike for G it. was um, one of the ones. Yeah, Mike like, G. There was I remember like was watching a ton that. of videos we watched. Yeah. Um, yeah. Else? yeah. Miko. Yeah. Miko, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Miko. Miko. Because it was like, it was during that time when we started doing the competitions like in the gym, like at yeah. like power, like when we had that. I think we watched the games. Yeah, that's when we... And then That's, we as, did a, we did a bunch of those events minus like the hill climb. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And when we did them, we were my mine and your times were comparable, yeah. and we were supposed to both compete. But Darren decided, I was like, "Wow, I'm going to be really good." <laughs> Darren <laughs> like, used to like anything over ten minutes. Darren would beat me at everything. Didn't matter what it was, and then he gave up. Yeah, <laughs> it was the double cheeseburgers. Then. Yeah, I we remember signing up for sectionals, and I called or text Darren I said hey it, it opened we need to sign up and he's like yeah yeah I'll sign up when I got home because <laughs> he was home from Michigan entry. for a couple yeah, didn't days have didn't have it's it. like Rich I need the card I need the card <laughs> yeah <laughs> and he didn't do it that card. <laughs> he didn't do it Could've I know been. yeah and I I really like thinking back on it too I really don't know like I mean I'm I, I'm not an individual like comp yeah, guy yeah. I'm just not like I've never liked it like wrestling I did it my whole life and I hated I hated that aspect of it like mm-hmm. I was like one of the guys you would call like a practice squad guy like I love practices I love doing all yeah. that but when it came time rolling to like, with the team yeah yeah yeah, like yeah rolling like with like, the team but when it came down to like an individual thing like spotlights on you yeah. i just didn't like it mm-hmm. i don't know if it was being I in it. I, just, I didn't know if it was like being in a big family oh, yeah. and like you're always doing something but yeah i mean like he would he would he would do great at it and uh yeah so like i think like as i'm sitting like i can't remember what i was doing like at the computer i don't even know if i even turned on like people rich saying i'm like yeah yeah f you <laughs> yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. you kidding me yeah i'm but like i want to kill i know streak. yeah it's just it's just crazy to like think at, at that time like where rich signed up ruined my spring break <laughs> we didn't ruin it we just took it well, we didn't ruin it, it but i had to I had to work out hammered or, or, or you know or, or or like hung over you know and stuff he's like hey i won this competition i'm like well no shit <laughs> When so you're ruining worried. the strip for me. It's nothing to do with me. Yeah. I'm 18. I want to go to the Sandpiper. <laughs> hey, what am I doing? Get a here? Hannah tattoo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you and Johnson disappeared, yeah, Johnson came back with a Batman, <laughs> Batman symbol. And then he left. Remember Hannah he just t- left? <laughs> he left early. He was like, Johnson We're goes, like two days go. into spring break. He Johnson's was like, like, I'm I want to go home. home. I was like, what? It was so bizarre. Johnson, man, what a... A freak of strength, though. Like, yeah. he should have pressed 265 or whatever. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I was like, I can't squat that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm, like, warming up to try and back squat I'm thinking about doing thing. that. Do you remember, I was talking about this the other day. Do you remember doing Grace, me, you, and Fizz? And we had to screw, like, we had to have two of us have the, 
a, a wrench to screw the screws back into the barbell because it kept oh falling gosh, off. Remember dude, that? That's or the right. first we, time we did Murph when we yeah, did 300 sit ups yes. instead of squats. <laughs> yeah. And we didn't have the internet on our phones. We're like, yeah, Murph's 100 pull ups, 200 push ups, and 300 <laughs> sit ups. <laughs> and Turner was standing there with Turner, the hose. So spraying like, us. Turner got done and was honestly like the guy for Billy Madison. Like, Rich and I, like, everybody's so, he was like, hey, <laughs> just spraying us. Like, spraying us as you're running in from your second mile. <laughs> you Navy SEALs. Oh, it was so good. Because he didn't do it. He was yeah, like, yeah, I quit. Wait, I'm not yeah. doing that. <laughs> so, so funny. Uh, I was up at Dad's. Man, we had, what, two stall mats. Dad put that little pull-up bar we had. It was, yeah. like, super thin bar. Yeah, <laughs> now the one that's up there is, like, thick. super yeah, thick. Yeah, super thick bar. What else did we have? We had two kettlebells, a 53 and a 70. Yep, yep, yep. And then those, uh, I not re- Bowflex, like, selector weights. They were some cheap no, selector No, 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 they were. I, they I weren't Bowflex, but, Bowflex, but they were some the cheap, yeah, like, yeah, selector weights. Yeah. They yeah. were pretty sweet. They, they were, were, like, fives were. to fifties, I think, or something yeah, like that. Yeah, well, I forgot there. about those. And then, and then yeah, like, we had, like, boxes, and then, like, we, we had the keg. Remember, remember yep. the axle bar? We used to yeah. do, like, the axle bar cleaning jerks. <laughs> we had Charles Peak built us that. It's, like. A solid piece of stainless. I think it's out here still. Yeah, yeah. It's heavy. It's the like what? sixty-five Heaviest. pounds. But like though. this was like an actual truck axle. Like oh, that. Like yeah. We would do cleans. Oh, we had with. that one yeah, too. Yeah, because like we'd have to do it like this. And you got the rust. And then McGoldrick and gave us the <laughs> McGoldrick gave us the keg. We had the keg. Yeah, do the keg. keg. We do the keg cleans. There was uh the tire flips. That was tire always flip. like the classic. You know. Yeah, my, I remember when my brother. Let's see. When my brother moved out, he had a kegerator. Wow. And so he would get a keg every now and then, and I would want to do. I would do like cleaning jerks with that as apartment because he had a keg, and it would like it'd be like half full sloshing around. Yeah, you did. <laughs> in between your bathroom runs. Yeah, and yeah. I'd clean this keg. I go to the back time. I'd be cleaning this keg. Do you remember the my wedding day workout with the that was uh, overhead squat, overhead squat, snatch. squat chest to bar? No, snatch, snatch overhead squat overhead chest, chest bar, bar. But the the bed it is you and Brandon Phillips. And the, the bed, bed is in right. the middle. <laughs> there's bed. a there's a video of it on yeah, YouTube. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. We uh the bed they gave me at the game. Is it like three six twelve or something? Three six twelve, I think. Yeah, or, yeah. It's like hundred and eighty five. Of course, I couldn't do it again. <laughs> it was three snatches, <laughs> yeah. six overhead squats, twelve chest bar for like six rounds or something. Yeah, like that. yeah. Or, or something, eighteen. Wow. I it think was it was something, something to do with the date. Six, six, eighteen. I can't remember. Anyway, we'll yeah. have to look it up. But it was that was a hard work. I remember was, we did it, it a terrible. couple years ago, again for the first time in a long time. But we, uh, the bed, the reverie bed is in the background. Yeah, I know. They, I, I wanted it at the games. We would, we'd lay on it. Too. Well, I slept on it. <laughs> yeah. We, uh, the night, so like that That's night, disgusting. the night before my wedding, we stayed at the barn and me and Billings, I Is remember slept on hey this, the bed. Uh, yeah, the wedding, type in Rich Froning wedding workout. That's what, I yeah, think. he did. Oh, okay. Brandon Phillips, maybe. Type in Brandon Phillips. Yeah, Rich Froning. Or, Man, I know, because yeah, Thomas was... Cox is filming it, I think. Sounds about right. So... So if you remember too, I didn't do it at that point. I actually came back and uh, did it later because I forget. Like, was I helping? Was I help set up or something? Or like maybe some I mean, uh, like with my family down like visiting. But I remember like them saying that. I'm like, dude, I can't do. This. <laughs> I can't do, I can't do this. I, I can't do this. I'm done. Yeah, I know it's crazy. Then um, what was uh, and then like handstand walking in there. Remember, like you would handstand walk in your dad's barn. You'd be on the rubber, rubber it was fine. and then and then you would get to the concrete, and you know you have your dad's Whoa. dust in. Well, your, that and the <laughs> yeah. slick concrete. Yeah, the, the slick the concrete. concrete. The wall ball target was eleven feet. Wall ball target out front was eleven, 11 feet. feet. Um, yeah, row, uh, muscle ups. Remember doing muscle ups on, on the, the short on the straps. Yeah. It was so good. You, though. you couldn't. You couldn't overswing you couldn't because overswing, the you stairs. Yeah, you, st- you had the step. Yeah, yeah, hit the stairs. And oh. they're 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 awkwardly wide. Yeah. just a little bit wide. Yeah. I thought they were pretty good. No, I well, like I mean, them, well, but they're I just mean, it's wider than any other correct. anything else. And the what was so nice too is that they were so weathered. Like yeah, so now you see like them now. Now you can't. You like get a splinter. splinter. Really they're that just they're just relics at this point. Yeah. Oh, dude. Yeah, but they were the best. They were. Yeah, we went up there to swim a couple weeks ago. That's it. And I show. That's it. <laughs> There's the back. <laughs> There's, the <background>. There's, the <laughs> There's Donovan. Donovan. Who is? Those shorts. Oh, Will. Will. Yeah, Will. There's the bed, and I love how it's like set up. Like <laughs> Oli shoes. Look at the Oli shoes too. Whatever happened? Whatever Look how happened? narrow my knees are on that squat too. Those, I wish the, my knees could do are that. Famous, still. man. Those are good too. They're hanging yeah. in the. No, oh, those aren't two poo. Those are uh, CrossFit.com, man. Oh, oh that's really? right. That's right. Those are the old school. That's right. Yeah. yeah, the shoes. What are you? Wait, wait. Are you wearing lifters? Oh yeah, those are the original. Yeah, the original Reebok, Reebok lifters. lifters. What's with the bed? Why is there a bed in there? So yeah. Reverie, when I won the games, I got a free bed, and we didn't have a house to put it in yet. <laughs> and so <laughs> it, stuffed uh, it up in the just left it up there. Yeah, 
go up there and so unlike you to sleep and get a workout in, you know? So unlike me to, face him to sleep? No, to oh, face him. Look face at him. that, like a little frog look kip. That little frog kip. Yeah. <gasps> Man, Dude. look at his camera work. And then the best part about this video, too, is like you can hear Thomas kind of like yeah. encouraging us. And he talk, <laughs> he's giving a highlight no, who's no, in that's there. That's uh, Taylor. Uh, yeah, there. oh yeah, my uh, Dustin. Did you see yeah, Dustin? Dustin. In there? Yeah, little guy. And you got Will Enix back there. Yeah. You got Donovan back there. Dude, that's so. that that's crazy though. See, oh, see the old sign? Old sign, the wrong phone number? Yep. That's my wrong phone number. <laughs> Luckily, somehow out of a stroke <laughs> Oh, of, Rich, I almost said this. Your wrong phone number. Yep. 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 So that neither of us would would answer anyway. No. Nope. People call <laughs> people call for a membership and I'm like, ah, it's spam. <laughs> it's spam. <laughs> they 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 don't want to sign up. Yeah. Rich, man, you're scaring me with these. Yeah, like six inches apart. Yeah, well, then Brandon's pretty much kissing you here. <laughs> oh, Brandon. He's, he was, he's he a was strong, though. Now, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Dude, he was he was a strong dude. I remember watching him do, I think it was on .com. It's one of the hero workouts. It's like row a 2K, run a mile, row a 2K. He smashed the Smashed row. it. Yeah. <clears throat> I remember like seeing that on Facebook, I think, before uh, semifinals and thinking, oh, I'm in big trouble. But dude, Brandon's you guys are going dude. fast. Yeah. Yeah, too I know. Fast. They, that's what would kill me with this is that they were moving too fast. Like, and this is actually after the original pull-up bar set right where Brandon's uh, bar is. Yeah, you like see right that light there? right there. There used to be a pull-up bar yeah. right there. This is kind of barn 2.0, and then what yeah. it is, and now yeah. it's like barn 3.0. Yeah. I remember a workout we'd do a lot early on too was the ten rounds of ten, 10 pull-ups and ten push-ups. Oh, that, that was, was the like, first the first the CrossFit workout we did. Yeah. But I mean, when, we, was, when we decided to like only do CrossFit, because yeah. back then we used to do a bunch of pump stuff. Yep. Do you remember the like ten rounds of run around the little tree down there and five reps of whatever it was? It was like yeah. anytime you were Go like down the hill, stumped on a workout, you're like, I'm gonna run do around the run around five the tree. or ten rounds of five squat snatch at 185. Run around that little tree. Is that tree still there? It's not there. Is oh, it? yeah. it's it got is. the like brick. Yeah, work yeah. I know. It. I know exactly what you're yeah. talking about. Or like five yeah. muscle ups. I've done. I've done workouts. It's probably like 150 run, maybe. Yeah, it's not super. We do bizarre. handstand push ups right in that little up. corner. Oh, man, oh, the corner, squat yeah, nook. And that corner would get so hot over there, too. Yeah, but remember those those squat those racks? Those white too. squat racks that we, we, were we, so sketch. Well, yeah, the freestanding, because, you know, of course, you know, I can only, you know, talk about your weights because mine, I didn't really use them for what they're supposed to be. <laughs> but yeah, like you'd have like 365 on there and you go to rack and the whole thing would shake. And I'm like, oh, my God. Do <laughs> you remember that workout that I, that I did with the high box jumps at Power? And, and you and I shattered your shattered shins. both shins uh. on concrete, <laughs> and it was like the week before semifinals. We we, we unrolled there it. Were, yes, there was skin we and hair on like it. literally like unrolled your skin, and I was, it was literally like I'm, snake skin. I, it like felt point. like I had shin splints for six months. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure I might have like fractured my shins. If you see it semifinals <laughs> that year, I think on one of the videos where I'm running, it was the final workout of like the squat snatch, clean and jerk, chest to bar run thing. Shin, I have yeah, like yeah, shin, I have tape run. on them or something <laughs> because. They hurt so bad. You remember uh, you know, Will so, Enix in his toe shoes too? Look at yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you laughing, man? Vibrams. <laughs> those, those are big. But uh, remember uh, one of our members too. Like there's he, McGoldrick in the background um, yeah. already. Well, one of our non-paying members. <laughs> um, every every time that he would like get a callus, remember D-Lo? Nope. He would rip it off oh, and he yeah. would he would hang it up. So we had calluses <laughs> hanging up above our whiteboard. <laughs> and, like, dude, he, he dude, so, so, so he was so proud of it. Funny story, not funny story. Bad story about this workout. Donovan. Oh, he t- well, he tore his hand, yeah, 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 yeah. and then he went and worked at um, in uh, Gatlinburg he, at uh, a yeah, water like park, yeah. a water park, and where his hand was open, he got MRSA. Oh, his hand swelled. looked like Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Yeah. He had to go to the hospital oh, yeah. and they had He's to like, like huh? clean it out and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Start sprouting ears. I don't know what happened. But yeah, his hand, man, it was so bad. The best part is that bed is just sitting right there. <laughs> oh, I would man. love to see the covers open and somebody's just sleeping. <laughs> yeah, just somebody just that like, Atlas hey, man. stone is still sitting out front. Those Atlas yeah. stones, too. That was actually a very underrated tool. I mean, like that. But you remember, as soon as you started sweating, you couldn't use it. But man, like if you could figure it out, like to pick it up when it was sweating, it was a oh, it was awful. Yeah, they were great. It was. Then you drop it in the whole barn. Like I would hate to see those mats get lifted up and see how bad. What are you laughing at, Scott? Will how skinny? Oh, hey, hey, hey. the uh, names on the mat. Oh yeah, 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 you bought a mat. This was brilliant. (laughs) We didn't have enough. (laughs) We didn't have money. (laughs) We (laughs) just give us a mat. No, 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 no. When we went to uh, when we moved. (laughs) 
when we moved to the 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 new gym from Power, we had this huge space and it was all concrete. We didn't. We had like six <laughs> mats. Just, just so we talked our members into they could sponsor a mat <laughs> and buy a mat and we put their name on it. <laughs> we you got don't like have to pay mats. us for six months. Uh, just give us a mat. <laughs> sorry, what were you laughing at, Scott? Oh my gosh, dude! Who, whoever keeps Will. moving the bars, yeah, because you guys are over at squatting and snatching it. He, he can barely to, move he it. Just has to pick it up, and his back's rounded. Like <laughs> he, a, is, he is literally <laughs> one RMing cat. it every single time. Oh, Will, Will is probably one of the original CrossFitters in yeah. this town. Uh, he actually taught us a good amount a lot too. Of stuff, yeah, yeah, he did. I, m- I remember, remember how he, he loved pose pose method running. Pose, pose method, method that, running. That, well, that's why he had the vibrams barefoot on. shoes. Yeah, remember how we for like six months we only. Crossfitted barefoot, not barefoot shoes. Barefoot, barefoot. yeah, yeah. We would yeah, run yeah. miles. We would do everything barefoot. Just bleeding all over the place. <laughs> like is this I, no this grips I'm, generation I'm, I'm so as well. Uh, at the same time, I might have just started wearing grips, but I don't think there's grips on my hands. Tape, there. No, no, no. Tape grips. Tape, tape grips. grips. Tape grips. But that was more, you weren't allowed to wear grips. I thought, right? And then we yeah, yeah, you weren't allowed grips. to wear grips, but we would Dude, make tape grips. Taping those yeah. things all the time. You had to yeah. sit there. You had you had to make sure that you timed out your workouts. So. At the APC, we're about to do one of the open workouts. Dan's making tape grips, and he, in the middle of the prayer, he's trying to poke a hole through the grip, (laughs) stabs himself, (laughs) and just yells, God, profanity. (laughs) In the middle of prayer. And cuts his hand. Oh, my god! In the middle of, like, right before one of the open workouts, gashes his hand. I don't think he had to get stitches. He's like, why me? But it was pretty. (laughs) Why? Why me? Man, look at that. That's when I had a full head of hair, no bald spot in the back. Look at that. Man, I, uh, I, I probably didn't have a hairline. I remember I knew how to make tape the grips so well. Necklace. I couldn't make it. I couldn't make a pair. Oh, I could right. still yeah, make them. Really? Oh, I heck couldn't. Yeah. I forget. Jackie how to make Cox it. could make the best of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She'd yeah. just sit at home and make, make them. Because you make the little well, the loop problem for the was fingers. if you made them too the, short, yeah, that they wouldn't make the tape, and then it would yeah. pull your hand down. So you it had was the like, opposite. It was like doing the. There opposite. honestly really was a science to it because like I remember. And then that company started making them. Yeah, natural grip. Natural grip. Yeah, because like you would have to, you would have to measure you your hand. People don't even know. You'd no, have dude, to measure they, your hand really like don't. this because you wanted it to be extra long. Mm-hmm. So you'd pull it back and you're okay. That's dude, what you're I'm about to smash tape. that chalk bucket. Can't wait. No, no. But, um, court awareness, man. Court awareness, dude. It is. It is crazy thinking back of the stuff we did with what little stuff. Well, that's like we that's had. what like, I always. You know, there were no knee sleeves. There was no knee there sleeves. Was no, there, was know, there was no machines. No other machines. You know. Yeah. Oh man. This is last round, bro. Come on. Nailed it. For, Suck it. for extra cardio, you know what we did? We grabbed a barbell, or you did more Cindy. Yeah, exactly. You know, you didn't have a skier. Yeah. You didn't have, we barely, this was no Airdyne. You had a rower. There was no anything. <laughs> I remember I, I remember going home and just putting my hands, like, in the freezer. <laughs> and just be like, ah. <laughs> Wait, up the next day, it's like, Rich, like, it's 10 rounds of 10 pull-ups, 10 push-ups. The hell? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, like going home, like grabbing like vegetable bags and just watching like TV. <laughs> Put like, hamburg- like hamburger guy, hands. Have the old guy yeah. taped him like, had him like taped on my knees. Hamburger hands. Yeah, hamburger hands. Yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, yeah I mean, this, this really, really though, is like a great, and so like much. that, but that whiteboard used to be filled. Like, the, yeah. I, I can't that believe was it's clean. such a terrible whiteboard. Yeah. We'd have to, every spray couple weeks, like you have to goo, goo yeah. gone. Yeah, yeah. Goo gone. You had to clean it up with goo gone. I remember there was, wow, Rich, at yeah, times. You do look different, man. At times, it Young. wasn't even, there's just like, whatever spray you could get, like Lysol. You spray with Lysol. Just something, to, something, something to get it wet. Something. I remember that the summer of my last year, me and Hobart just sat there. And just wrote out a thousand yeah. workouts. Yeah. And then we'd walk up to it the next day. We'd be like, you want to do one of these? And we'd be like, no, nah, let's write something else up. <laughs> you know, we'd have, a, there was so many on yeah. there. Dude, look at that though, man. Like, and after that, you got married. <laughs> look at me. The today. look of disappointment on both ends. Okay, so it was three, six rounds of three, six, nine. I don't know where those, huh? I thought it was 12. Must have been a Kid Rock song yeah, or something. or. Workout. It is pretty hard workout. Yeah, that's a ter- that's a terrible. That still, one. is a hard workout. A, that, that really is a bad workout. That's what I'm saying. Like some of the stuff that, like, I, re- I remember, like when we first uh, when we first there at Max's, you were you were doing a power clean, and that's the first time that I saw a split. But you like you like old man squatted it in like into the split. You like touched both, you touched <laughs> your knee to the ground, and it was like two hundred two hundred like sixty five pounds ago. 
that's cool. <laughs> I know you wow. still do it. Yeah, and I was like, I'm going to split. Because <laughs> squatting's stupid. I think we watched a video of Josh Everett, and he split. Maybe, yeah, so yeah, because we he like, talked about, because yeah, like back then, about right? Because like, too. Yeah, I mean, because well, like, that was he had legal, like, though. Yeah, he had like poor mobility in his ankles or something. Yeah, yeah. still yeah. technically still legal. Does, oh. Right, you, you can still split. As long as your knee doesn't touch. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. But, yeah, we started doing that. They usually, yeah, they usually brief it in most events are like that you can split clean or whatever unless it says well no no clean. but 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 olympic lifting I yeah oh yeah 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 that's what i'm saying like i, mean, I, split jerk, like, I saw it and i was clean? like wow that's yeah. actually really cool it yeah because yeah. like we were maxing out that and uh do you remember do you remember i always tell people this too like remember when i was maxing out back squat and i'd have a, i'd have this problem where not not like your bathroom problem but i would have this problem like where every time i would the bar would get heavy my hands would shoot off the bar and i would and i would and i would push out my and, 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 and i would literally push you out like max my quad. And, you go. <laughs> and i just push off my quad stand it up and it's like done count <laughs> like you just yell it go gosh dang it i got it but like I, I'd be standing up, I'd be shaking, it'd be, it'd be, like, it'd be like 200 and hands? like 25 pounds <laughs> in my hands. I'd be pulling on the bar so hard they'd shoot off the bar and push on my quads. They but the bar st- would still be on the back. Stay. Yeah. Oh, man. You remember, do, that. do you remember the first time we did Linda and we didn't have enough bars in your basement? We, we did the deadlift. We did the deadlifts with preacher curl <laughs> yeah. bar. JJ, it was JJ, me, you, JJ, yeah, Pat, JJ Adam, probably Dustin. Yeah, yeah. It was in your basement on yeah, the carpet. And then, uh, <laughs> and then, yeah, and then like power cleans, we had like the super small like change plates. So you went all the way down to the was ground. that what it was? I yeah, remember well, that yeah, part. Yeah, because remember in, in my basement. Or, but I, I thought mean, we just had metal plates. Yeah, but we did. That's no, what, oh, okay. like on the power cleans because yeah. we had to save those for the deadlift. We yeah. used the bigger plates for the deadlift <laughs> preacher curl bar. <laughs> and then on the power cleans, we had the small like fives and ten like oh. change plates. And I rem- yeah, because I remember like it's probably the first time I ever power cleaned, really. <laughs> oh my god! Curl bar yeah. dead. Oh, yeah. Man. yeah, preacher curl. Preacher curl deadlifts. I think yeah. we did the, all the prescribed weights and everything, but it was like yeah, because we didn't have we used the big metal plates for the deadlifts on the preacher yeah. curl bar, and we didn't have enough big plates. Yeah, yep, yep. I know. <laughs> I know. Yeah. yeah, I I, uh, I learned to butterfly pull up. This is very similar. I learned to butterfly pull up on one of those wall mount pull up bars with the doorway door jam. What was his name? Bar. Um. Uh, the uh, P90X guy, Tony. Tony Horton. No. When it t- no, no, no. Tony know. Horton's the gazelle. I don't know. I don't know. Him. But yeah, that's I. I learned because it, and it would like kind of What's shake every time I would kip kip back on it. And then my friend had a bench press and like had the tiny little bench press bar yeah. on like the little, <laughs> the, you know the. Oh yeah, the, the one rack like is, where like, they're right super here. narrow. And yeah. so like yeah. there's nowhere really to grab it. So you have to grab outside it almost. <laughs> yeah. Yep. And I remember telling him, I think, I think I. Uh, Tony Horton. It, was it Tony is Tony. Horton. Okay. Right. I think I even back check. I think I maxed out my overhead squat in his base at one time. Heck yeah, you did. On the on this, what I would do is I would sit on the bench and I would get underneath the bar and I would like kind of <laughs> curl it onto my back and I would stand up and put it over my head. And I remember telling him he was upstairs and I was in his basement. I said, if uh, if I scream and the and then you hear the and then you hear the bar drop, it's good. But if you hear the bar drop and then you hear me scream, come check on me. <laughs> <laughs> I remember how hard I yell. <laughs> yeah. I saw an old video from Averett of me maxing out my overhead squat on Facebook, and it's like a real grainy, potatoey video. <laughs> yeah, like uh, uh, yeah, like an MB on, Touch. Yeah, it was on my like <laughs> Facebook, my personal Facebook, which I don't even know how to even access that anymore, but it's on there somewhere. <laughs> old, old, old days. Good old days. Yeah, I know, and I think I I pulled up. I think I watched a video the other day. It's like when uh, CrossFit.com came. Or CrossFit came and they filmed you do like the CrossFit.com workout, seven sets of three overhead squat or something. But that was at like Mayhem. I mean, like, or that was at the one where we were downtown. Do you remember when you broke your foot, dropping a 45 pound barbell on your foot, oh my doing God. filthy 50? Yes. Darren just pitches the barbell, empty <laughs> barbell on the like 50 push press and it <laughs> falls on his foot. Cause that workout oh. was, that workout was my jam because it was all like, you know, it was yeah, light, like body much. weight. So yeah, I know. So <laughs> Jumping I was like, <laughs> yeah, dude, <laughs> yeah, he goes with, with an empty barbell drops it from uh, overhead on his foot, breaks yeah. his foot or the time, <laughs> or you guys were <laughs> doing that. Double, ag- I'm doing double. I'm one like, foot. Ah, and then we did the ah. sevens like that next week and you're doing one thirty five <laughs> thrusters with one leg or Johnson when Johnson two times. There's two separate stories with Johnson. Johnson, they were Dude, doing he was so funny, filthy man. 50. Or, yeah, it was. Or, <laughs> it might have been the same day. It might have been 50, 40, 30, 20, 10, hip extension, double under, or something like that. But he was racing <laughs> Darren, and he goes to jump in to the GHD, and this was an old, I forget the company. It was all tight? You know, was uh, it it wasn't Titan. Uh, but it had, at the bottom of the GHD, the, it had yeah, the, like this the, really sharp edge, and the foot things went out like this. 
and he goes to hook his feet in and doesn't hook his feet uh, in. Yeah, and he goes down for his hip extension, forehead. Oh, right on perfect the, line like across. A, he had to go get stitches. He had to get six stitches. <laughs> he hits it, flips out of it on the ground, and he's like this. And I'm still, I'm just like, oh my god, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna win, <laughs> dude. Here's the filthy fil- fil- yeah. <laughs> Here's the filthy fil- fifty. Him. It's such a ridiculous workout. <laughs> it really is. Fifty box jumps, twenty inch. Fifty jumping pull ups. Fifty <laughs> kettlebell swings with a. This has a twenty five pound. I think it would be used a thirty five. Thirty five, but it's Walking a cardio record. Steps, yeah. Fifty knees to elbow. 50 oh push press gosh. with a bar, 50 back extensions, 50 wall balls, 50, 50. burpees. That's like the yeah, whole, workout yeah, right whole workout right there. <laughs> 50 double unders. Yeah. 50 double unders. 50 double unders. <laughs> that was I back remember. in the day when it was hard. Yeah. yeah. You should do 50 double unders between each of those movements and then scale them <laughs> yeah. to modern day at yeah. this point. I remember, oh, my gosh. Yeah, dude. I remember doing it. Like, is the, 50 you know, hip extensions is a, or back, whatever they want to call it. Back extensions, yeah. hip oh, extensions. Oh, they're supposed to do yeah. the back. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Well, I'm sure you yeah, In a workout, it would be hip extensions. I know. Back but is, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. yeah they, they the get terminology. All, turn it to GHDs. Translation's yeah. been lost. That would be a bad time. We should We should do a modern day. Modern day, filthy yeah. 50. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, um, I remember the, the 50 feet. burpees was a whole... Because you get to the 50 burpees, it'd take like seven minutes to get there, and then you'd be there for like 10 <laughs> yeah, minutes, yeah. and then you get to yeah. the double unders. We used to have a, a a metal wall, too. Like, all the... Like, it was... It, it was, was an old warehouse, so it was yeah. metal. And... Or sheet, sheet metal. And remember how Johnson could not figure out how to, like, kick up into a handstand? He would just crash He into would just it. ram and into the wall. Or the, or the, or the <laughs> clapping handstand <laughs> push-up. I told, I told him, I go, Johnson, you should try clapping handstand push-up. <laughs> And he goes, really? He about <laughs> broke his neck. Because, like, it was at the time we were getting, like, good at him, yeah. you know? So I was like, I was like, dude, I, I that's think coming that next. would be really cool. Because clapping he push-ups, dude. Yeah. <laughs> neck is sideways on the ground. He's like. I had this old Jeep I'm Wrangler. Like, I'm, I'm not doing that. Another <laughs> Johnson <laughs> story is I had another Jeep, an old Jeep Wrangler, and it had glass headlights. And yeah. you'd have to just kind of, like. Yeah, it had. It, do it that. Had a short one of them. Oh, and it yeah. would. It would. It would, Kick on. Yeah. So I go to start the Jeep. We were going somewhere. I forgot it was one night. <laughs> and we were leaving the gym. So bad. Like, Johnson, go just give the, the headlight a tap. Yeah. <laughs> Straight through, slits his wrist <laughs> vertically. <laughs> like, and he's like, <laughs> we had to rush him to the emergency room. And he's, he's like, like hospital. He's like, Rich, I'm getting cold. <laughs> There's no top on the Jeep. Yeah, it's no like job. 50 degrees. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, cold. I'm cool too, man. It's okay. Like, he thinks he's, he's dying. Like, yeah, John's like, did you cut your wrist too? <laughs> did you? <laughs> There was no halfway point with him too no. because he was he was like one of those guys. If you told him to do it, he would do it, and he would do it all. Or out. he'd be in the gym every day, all day for six months, and then he'd be like, you know what, guys, I think I'm getting. I was a little too obsessed with this. You wouldn't see him again for three months. Yeah, he would go back to like Cookville Fitness and bodybuilding. <laughs> yeah. and stuff. He had like little man syndrome is yeah. what it was. Yeah, it was yeah, like yeah. as soon as he would start to lose a little bit of weight or like get fit, he'd be like, and he was fit. I mean, he was a fit dude, yeah. And then he would just be like, ah, I can't do this. I'll never forget too, like when Dusty's, we were actually just telling this story too. Dust, we were doing this little competition as well and Dusty Hill was counting for him. And Dusty's one of the worst counters. I mean, I'm like, bless his heart. As, as, as far as having like, for him to count your reps, like you don't want him to count your reps. <laughs> and, and I remember like the workout had like 50 or like so like handstand pushups or like maybe a hundred kipping. Like in it, Johnson is sweating. He's this big, like gorilla guy and stuff. And Dusty, you know, is just a little Dusty. And Johnson is doing these. He gets down. He goes, "What am I at, Dusty?" And Dusty lost guy. He goes, "Uh, I think he got twenty five left." He goes, "Fuck!" <laughs> 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 it. And there's cheerleading, cheerleading camp. A little kid from <laughs> kid cheerleading camp. Johnson, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Ah, twenty five. <laughs> you know, he doesn't know. <laughs> Uh, I know we had this wall that separated us, but it had a big gap. Like, yeah. So there was no separation of sound. Our yeah. music, yeah, their music, yeah, their music, they're going to be playing M- hard Eminem. Oh, drop, yeah. yeah, Drop the World by Lil Wayne would be <laughs> yeah. playing on repeat. Yep. <laughs> it's uh, like it's like pain is on. Yep. And, oh, my gosh, dude. Yeah, we'd have three, like, three days grace blaring. Yeah, and they'd be like, hey, grace. after 3 o'clock, can you guys uh, tone <laughs> you the guys music? Tone you know, like, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> that carried over into the new gym. I'm like, guys, yeah. put it edited on. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. 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 Well, it's just at here. that time where like stuff like that was cool. <laughs> that was <laughs> yeah, cool. yeah. It, it was cool to have loud screaming music. I know we'd have uh, Hollywood Undead was big Hollywood at the time. Undead. So yeah, yeah. you were big on three hundred three. Three hundred three. Yeah. Three hundred three. Oh. oh my gosh, dude! Yeah, they'd be screaming. I'm undead. like, <laughs> yeah, Undead, and I just. Yeah, like these moms are working out. I'm like, I'm sorry, I'll put on like Chicago or something or like AC, you know, something like that. 
I'm like so uh, sorry. The good old days. Look at us now. I know. Darren running the best too is Darren moves up to Michigan. He's like, you know, gonna open a gym. COVID hits, couldn't open a gym. So we started <laughs> the affiliate stuff and then Yeah. We're Jake comes to me, he's like, Hey, Darren asked, do you, do we still want him to open a gym? I was like, absolutely not. I mean, affiliate <laughs> stuff's doing good. He's bu- busy with that. What's and like I'm thinking Darren too. wanted to do that. And so I'm like, Darren, you don't have to open a gym. And he's like, thank God. <laughs> Dude, I was, I was like swaying this whole Cause like Jess and I, that was like, like, I love the whole gym scene. I loved it. Like that. The I, community I mean, side of it. Which yeah, you still exactly. Get it, it is. It is. And stuff. But it's like, you know, that's when I was just coaching and you know, me, who I am, it's like, Dude, I cannot own a gym. I mean, like for me to, I mean, for, for like me to be Darren, able to okay, like, so yeah, it's I've like, said you know, I'm multiple, a great like people's time. person. Tar- Darren is one of the best coaches as far as Write that down. high <laughs> level, <laughs> high level all the way down to beginner. Yeah. And he's just a really good people person. Very good at, um, you know, recognizing how pe- different people need to be motivated, how uh, to coach people through movements, new, old, young, whatever. Darren is the worst when it comes to Look at me Administ- trying to get memberships. Administ- <laughs> administrative <laughs> stuff. Like, yeah. no, I, hey, I, I Darren, so and so's not doing whatever coaching wise. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, um, and won't do it. Or allowing people to take advantage by putting stuff in the gym that they weren't paying for, making money. I was trying to help him out. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sorry. Darren's yeah. got sorry. too big of a heart. You yeah. Know? yeah, sorry. You you know, know, excuse my cousin yeah, Eddie. Yeah, yeah. His heart's a little bit bigger than his brain. <laughs> yeah. That's Darren. appreciate that. Appreciate so, it. The affiliate stuff made perfect sense. It did, it did. And, you know, and I was so, like, grateful to, to it because, yeah, that, that fit, like, my mold perfectly because, like, the whole time I'm thinking, too. In that, and it's like, you know, like, we were just having kids. I'm like, man, if I'm, you know, if I'm doing this, I'm yeah, running back and forth. Oh, my gosh. And, I mean, again, like, yes, you know, if it ever falls into our lap to, like, where it makes sense and it works out. Yeah, stuff but, like that, you know. Yeah, sure. I would. I would love to be part of it. But like I said, at JJ's at the yeah at Fin Gym. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Fin um, Gym. You guys have <laughs> what? You run like two classes, two or three yeah. classes. Yeah, out yeah, there, yeah. And, yeah. So and it's and it's awesome. And your dad, you get to. I got coach my dad, dad working out. Twelve years of my uh, 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 of our life doing this. My dad would never. Fourteen years. Fourteen <laughs> years. She's I'm old. But it's like he never was once interested in <laughs> touching it or doing anything. Like he loved watching watch all the, the videos, stuff. yeah, watch everything. all the videos, but never. And all of a sudden, he like he got hooked. He's like everybody, you know, like they they like get a sip of it, you know, or you know, or just try it out. And now he's all in. Like he comes awesome. in, he goes, "Hey, you know, like Rich is, you know, I saw Rich like do, doing this and stuff, or like he like get done with the work." I goes. Man, I really pushed hard through those thrusters, but man, like that bike, you know, I really think that I could have paced them and go, Dad, you don't have to, you don't, you don't have to, you don't tell me this, you know. Or he's like, Hey, you know, Just I saw, it. you know, I mean, I saw Rich doing this a couple of years ago. Dad, I lived it. I was <laughs> yeah, there. I was there. Yeah, yeah, I was like, I, I was there. You know, he's like, Oh, hey, like those new shorts coming. I was like, Dad, if you want them all, you know, <laughs> See what I can do. I'll, <laughs> use, I'll use my stipend. Yeah, yeah, I'll exactly. talk to Greg. Yeah, 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 exactly. I was like, Just give me a little bit. Let me build up a little bit of money. But you know, it is. It's it, it's great. And he's got, like, some of his friends, like, now doing it and stuff, which is cool. They're all talking about it. But there's nothing more stressful than coaching a parent. Oh, yeah. Or a spouse. A spouse. Oh, oh my yeah. gosh. Kid, I, granted, I'm not, I'm not coaching my kids yet, but oh, I dread dude. that day. Don't like, I did coach T-ball, and I know that you jumped into coaching. Coach's pitch. Yeah, and stuff, which T-ball's like, you know, you're just herding cattle, or you're just letting them loose yeah, yeah, out yeah, there. Yeah. Coach's like, pitch hey, is the same the way. Coach pitch is the same yeah, way. Yeah, you know, you're just pray to God that, you know, your kid's not the one being the issue, and it usually is, <laughs> you know. When I, yeah, when I was when I was coaching at the gym and I was competing, I would come home from the gym, and I, like, when I was living with my parents, I would come home, and my dad was the same thing. I was yeah. coaching my dad. Like, he would, he would be, because we had a home gym, and I would just write, whatever the class workout was, he would just do that at home, and so I'd write it for him. And he, some of the stuff, like, was fine, you know, because he'd yep. been working out his whole life. But, like, power cleans, never done a power clean. Yep. He's a 50-year-old guy. And, dude, and it's hard to, like, communicate that. Oh, like, dude. When, I mean, like, when it's your dad because, you know, like, as, like, to We're a screaming at each or, other. or an athlete, it's yeah. like, yeah, you can talk to him. No, like, yeah. when it's your dad, yeah. My dad, what are you doing? Yeah, it's like, yeah. why can't you just do it? Yeah, I, because just do he, it. 
him, him, or me yelling at him is like him yelling at me as a kid. Yeah, Why are you it's so the same stupid? Thing. Yeah, <laughs> it's the same like, thing. Like, when you you're doing your out? math homework, yeah. I'm like trying to teach him a kipping pull up, and you just cannot grasp it. <laughs> he goes, Why do I need a kip? I'll just do a strict pull up. I'm like, You're never going to be able to do that many strict pull ups. <laughs> you remember dude. my dad oh, working out one oh time? Oh my gosh, dude. One time it was bench up at the barn, bench when and he, something else, when but he I don't remember. Up with shorts on, I about lost it. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I about lost that. One you cannot be serious. I know you had legs. Yeah, he was like, I'm going to start working out. I think it was, it was a like row Lieutenant and a bench Dan workout. <laughs> never again. Never saw row and bench, and that was it. And yeah, what's so remember. crazy is your dad moves so well, yeah. too. Yeah. I mean, like he's got that, a great that, squad. that is like he does. He's he has jacked. a phenomenal. Yeah. yeah. You know? The guy he's can lean, do whatever yeah. he can with a cigarette, you know. And <laughs> cigarette, stuff. It's, of course. It's, cra- it's, it's crazy. But I know. I was like thinking about that, too. We're an hour and a half in. We could keep talking, but an hour and a half is probably the attention span of most people. And yep. I hear a kid yelling. So Yeah, I know. That's probably mine. I think, yeah, I think Sam and Zoe are out there, too. Yeah. Gotcha. You got to go to the bathroom? I got to pee. No, I actually, <laughs> I just have to pee, actually. Hungry, so. oh, really? All right. Darren? All right. Good job replacing Rory yeah. once we got past all the, Thank you. the poop yeah, stories wonder, in the beginning. Yeah, I, I think it was how good. This, how people are going to take this. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, this is a pretty... Uh, yeah. This is way... Off, off, yeah. yeah. Hopefully this helps cure a lot of your guys' problems. <laughs> <laughs> and just Yeah, and just realize that there are others out there that suffer from it as well. Stuttering. All right. Peace.